playing it a little bit up. You said that her medium punch is better, so that means better checks on dry brush. Her crouching light punch has been improved in a way where it makes for more consistency, which is something that hockey players have been begging for yep. since the drop. Oh, we'll see though. Marissa, I mean, relatively unchanged. Uh, she doesn't really need anything, I don't think. But I think she's in a great spot. <laughs> she's, I think she's in a really good spot. She feels really balanced. Her risk reward is very, very high. She still has a little bit of trouble with anti airing, but as you can see right there, immediately going to the EX stance, just armors the jump in. Absolutely A OK. Overhead as the knockdown. Let's get that drive impact on the wake up. There's the Gladius. You pointed out a really good option with the anti air. Okay, really like the use of OD Slither there, just to get out of the corner, apply the poison, but we are not afraid to press leads with the target combo, but there's the back throw. Rock rush, impact, it's a wrap, yeah. If you try to impact right back, you're gonna die. We'll help for that transaction. And Ridley Dragon, with the first victory. As you mentioned, I, I like Marisa in this game. You know, people see if she touch the Marisa kind of thing, but she still has to work to get those moments to happen at high level. And so the fireball, careful now. Jumping with the jump here, command grab. We cancel, we go for some uh, more of that grip instead. Yeah, look for that early extra damage. Definitely like the idea. Goes for the jump in, does make it across, but ah, the neutral jump in response. I like that idea. Set up. Where are you going with command grab? Only parry, so extra damage as well. Drive rush, command grab again. Oh, it's taking the heavy kick. Drive attack right back. A good reaction should definitely be able to kill it here unless you want to conserve that meter but no we are just going to spend that level three just make sure you take out the kill no, no dilly dallying yeah secure it yeah you see the bar at the bottom she can make a return over seat at any point you don't want that to happen you don't want that one gladius in the ca into cnx round i wake up ca oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> skip, skip, ahead, skip ahead a little yeah. bit Ow. <laughs> <laughs> one to one though on the rounds. Oh, the Superman punch. Look really? how much room that buys you as well. Already pretty much to the corner, but the jump out. It's just cleanly out of trouble. Poison applied. That makes extension. That more damage. Got a conversions as well. Back up to like it is Gladius. Impact right back though. Able to cancel and stay solid. Will they aim for the drive gate? I don't know. Aim for level one? No. The knockdown is fine. Okay, he's able to get out of the poison there. Still has CA, gets the command throw. Next hit will kill on anything that's special cancelable here. Anybody side wakes up, gets the back throw. Not enough though, the fireball don't fall on it. I'm stepping it. Oh no, and coming down from the heavens, just poking at the feet. Does find the throw afterwards. It hit at a really awkward angle, so I don't think that they were expecting uh, to be out of hit stun or block stun at that mm. point already. You see the fear that person's got? You see the absolute, they saw the bar at the bottom. But I look at either of these story. characters, me too, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Drop a chauffeur ahead. That's standing up. Getting blessed right there. You see the trying? Maybe whip punish that, uh, whip punish it. But you, know, you have heavy kick maybe to deal with the uh, Gladius. Yeah. She can also low profile in some ranges too as well. So she has some tools to deal with. You just have to know that matchup in the range that can do that. It's a punish, you're close. Okay, good place in there. Oh, finally, the drive impact actually does connect straight through the fireball. Gets the trade for the second time. Man to man, trade to trade right there. Runs up the medium, can see OD knockdown. Pick up with the crouch fears. Jump in to get the win. Literally, rounding it back and saving that part of the bottom. We haven't seen it utilized just yet. Closer and closer to that level three. Rocks are super aggressive there. Tries to take a couple, <laughs> uh, you know, a little bit of liberties there, but doesn't quite work out. And now a third of your life bar off the table for your trouble. Does break the armor, though. Glad he's trying to cut through. The tires right there. Same heavy kick still. Mm, the jump in works out early on the draw. They got the bar at the bottom. All they need is one opening. Gladius, level three, will the victory. They're looking for it. They're hunting for it. All oh, cool fate. We'll see it just yet. Jump finds the throw, poison still applied, gets the overhead, and is gonna go straight into the CA. You can't see it, but on the other side, the Aki player is gulping. I even heard it over here. One touch. Oh, the jump in against the fireball. What a call out. We've seen that fireball, whether it be OD or normal fireball, as like a establishment kind of tool. Yeah. Like locking him down, but that just allows an easy jump in to come on. Good job with the up forward. The confidence there to be able to just go straight in, go to the command throw. Like I said, not, not lacking confidence for a second. That command throw has been used pretty liberally so far in the set. Mm -hmm. Clear it on. Yeah, you 
said before, not really at that department, but damage can definitely be dumped out here. Grand kill. Oh, they actually get thrown. Be careful now. In burnout. One of the other stuff burnout is definitely Aki. Stan beating Park over and over again. Pushing to the corner. Can see the punish counter, but no follow up right there. Oh, no. It's just a tiny bit of life remaining and a, just a step kick. To be able to blow through the fireball. Never even gets off the hands. That is such a common thing, is that step kick continuously against like fireball characters. He'll take the train, especially if you have the lead. Oh, for the drive impact right after. It's heavy kick, it's snake kicks, it's a walk up throw. It's also poison applied. Okay. Also fireball. Yeah, fireball is definitely good, especially because he kind of scouted out that the new jump is coming out quite often. Drive rush. One more touch. But again, two touch three, so can end this real quick. All three is two openings. With CA, open. sequence. This is the, that was the only opening you needed there. CA was available. Yo, spin the win. OD, oh my god. The charge up, do whatever it takes. What? As an entire? <laughs> they like it? Really? There, there. Please. One gladius, but again, too far out for that to happen. Now, Fireball gets the fix. He's gonna leave his round apiece. Final round. Man, cruel fate. No. Be with the fireball. I'm not sure what they thought was going to happen there, but it probably wasn't that. Target couple comes through again, <laughs> and here we go with the punish counter. To the corner. We jump. Where are you going? Another command grab, luckily. Was that punish counter? Such a damage to took that right after. Goes in, and that's so smart. You go for that low profile, you put a stance right there. Blowing up, and there's the uh, OD. There's a job though. Try to go for another chance for the interruption. It's level three. That should be enough though. In the yellow, the damage is not mellow. And that grip is enough to do it. But you're off site. But you're here right now. Enjoy some street fighting with us. Kim versus DJ. Kim versus DJ. Oh, Black X will continue. You love to see it. <laughs> you love to see it. Black X was on the screen. Yes, yes. And it's still excellent in terms of the character uh, power that DJ has. The slave play with the nerf, but. Not so bad in burnout when they're in burnout. He's still top five. He's top five. He's still top five. I think he might be top five. I think you actually, I think he actually still might be top five because it's gonna happen to other characters. Definitely. Swaying is the only thing he got, but right now he is getting tossed in the corner by this lady and he's getting baited. And oh my god, look at the damage. Yeah. Let's the corner where she can exit for most of it. Fred Cannon Lamb with the pickup and the perfect KO, Vicky Viper. But Cannon with Vicky has, you know, woken up and is just ready for the day because a perfect KO himself at the beginning of the set is insane. That okay. is, I guess DJ too as well. Man. You know, we don't have a reversal like other characters. Give the aggression on ASAP. I get the Ooh. nice call on the front of the The teleport needs to get the slide apply. Oh, what a lovely He's a jack knight kind this time around. Oh, the sway, but really good. We got a parry on deck. Big count here, but no firm. This man is jumping, though. Yeah, late. I feel like one of them that a little bit until they show that they have the crouch against Antire. Up in the corner, not where she wants to be. She wants to be the reverse, doesn't really have the reversal. Step on the face of the end. Disrespecting the woman, the woman history mouth is insane. <laughs> oh, deep for the knockdown. Another DP. And that looked like he caught him on a tail end of a little shimmy walk back, walk forward. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Get the DP coming through. Bobbery. Might see some base for Vicky Viper. So that's all that damage. No level three. Where we get level three, not just yet. She the can to land. I thought you'd only get that level three immediately. Like yes, ASAP, please. get the buff, the speed. Vicky with the size, which oh, gets hit the drive impact. No. Oh, bro, it's gonna level three. It might be coming through to kill the drive cage. No, no, you know. Set up the step. Says he's going for the zone. He says, you know what? I'm winning in neutral. I don't need to worry about anything. But oh, no, you tried to jump at Kimberly. This could be a bad news. Bear. Hey, one confirmed is better. Oh, drive impact right back. Oh, I have reactions. It's not too early in the morning. Not yet. Not yet. There's a level three after this. The Vagabond, the pickup to put him down. Look at the sound clouds. And it's funny because this is like DJ track, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a fan. <laughs> Graffiti on deck. Yeah, she's a fan indeed. The sound of music is going to kill the beat of DJ. The Moroccans are down. Mm -hmm. But the spray cans are up, okay? I like that. Also, like the fact that she is playing an aggressive state. Maybe more level three earlier, but she's doing a fantastic job of keeping up with the character. Valvary. Sweat. I get it. Praying to God, like, please don't mix me. Man. Please, God, don't mix me. You know, you know what's crazy? I've always talked about people with the PTG method, and people don't use the PTG what's method. The pray to God, okay? Pray, to, pray God. to God. The pray to God method. The pray to God method. And he just did it, because a lot of people don't do that, okay? When no, you're dealing with mix, I'll be saying you don't pray hard enough. You're supposed to pray to you guess right. Pray to whatever's up there, like, please. Yes. Whatever's up there, please bless me. And the ability to the somehow block. Because, man, 
Dealing with Kimberly's mix is not fun. Okay. It's like the run overhead and things like that. She gets the corner carry off the quickness. You know, you have better buttons in neutral, so you yeah. can out button her. You got the fireballs too. But it's like one call out into the corner. She still has that. Like, people don't talk about that enough. Like, her corner carry is insane. But she just has no DP, so when you knock it down, she's not getting back up. And it's pretty, uh, it's pretty tough. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my goodness. The low forward after the drive rush. And look at the damage off this. The can set up. Again, another DP. But I guess what I can tell, like, if you go set up the can, I think you got to back up a little bit and let them whip and then get a big damage. Tom mm. gets it back right back, though. I have to react, Sean. Gotta have those. And that's death back. back. Yeah, it's been a ball. How you do? Oh, oh not to because the overhead's coming through, blessing the head, finishing out the prayer, and that is going to be the first round. Peace be with you. And also, with you, all this bracket possibly, it's Viper. Try to move on in pools, strike that elbow drop. You see the walk under, staying solid, staying fear drop. If I, my man is sending these out, saying, oh, uh oh, so she could upper, didn't link. Man, he thought it was Tekken, he did a tornado, but he couldn't get the combo. That's what's. <laughs> again, oh, no. does get the grip this time, the explosion, OD pickup. You spend it there, you going for seven. Oh, yeah, it's over. Oh, <laughs> it's over. As, for the soon, as soon as I saw the cancer, I'm like, he's going to go for grab. He's going to whip. Oh, that sucks so bad. That's a GG. Shaking my hand. Vicky Viper taking it two. Oh, he's going to move. Oh, the it's the uh, quick. The stuff, sis. Good seeing people from you know other games. Well, she didn't play five, but make her waste for her stock, which she has to really work to get. And then she tries to stock up on the neutral. Got that fast, long distance. You same bolt drive rush to get in and stop that pressure. But at the same time, if she gets in, it can be a little disastrous for DJ if she guesses right, you know? Like that command grab the Yoki afterwards and yeah. guess between plus frames is actually pretty solid, but we're gonna find out. He's back on the boat and he has attacked us from the speed. Did you wake, wake up, up SPD? What? Are you good? No, man, it's a grown woman. It's a grown woman. Oh, <laughs> Hello? We weren't familiar with your That's game. That's how you feel? Yeah, sometimes you got to. You got to lay it on the table. Throw the whole, um, the whole input, okay? The, the whole, whole input. input. The whole 360. Oh, oh that was a shimmy. Brother. And a half. All command grab whips goes for the toes. And guess what? 20% of the throw and get burnt out against DJ in the corner. Oh, this is, this is terrible. This is terrible. Oh. Crouching media to take it. Boom. So nice parry. But no confirm off of it though. Gets a clad. Two plus frames. Wrestle jab right there. Oh, whip, but still gets a drive impact. A bait can have. I like that actually. Look at this air combo. Wait a second. Are we playing marble, baby? In the corner. Wink clad. Nope. Take you back of the turn. Mm. I mean, without the wink clad, you can take back the turn. Minus a minimum. And this. spins to level three, gonna get the kill. Just, you know what? That was actually pretty good. That was two bait sets, sometimes reactions with the DI back to back. Yeah. And then instantly just um, going for a uh, level three afterwards. I like that actually. But uh, let's see how Lumen, you know, says, okay, let me lean forward at 45 degree angle. Let me lock in. So let me shrimp in. Let me lock in. Let me shrimp. Hey. Uh, yo, that's a lot of bargain spent though. Yes. I feel like you maybe could have killed with a different route. Level one might have killed, but still, we'll see what happens. Oh, we press the button. That's what's happening right now. Okay. It's fire, crouch fears. Stock, yep, sweep off the feet. But when, when, one wind spark means plus frame right here. Have a plus. Go to the OD immediately. We're not dealing with it. We'll just sway, but nothing afterwards. No sway in the morning. DP, dash up throw. Step step the corner go. Do it again. Oh my god. Do it again. That's a punish kind of two as well. He heard you. Do it like, again. I got you. I, I got you. <clears throat> Four throws in a row. She hasn't got a reversal. If it, if it ain't broke, don't fix it, all right? If you know you're in your opponent's head, keep stepping on their face. You don't give a damn. You don't. Because <laughs> why, why, why press anything else? You're going to get hit with crouch fears and the punish counter and the death. But at that point, taking too many throws. That's the name of the game. Got to switch it up. Get to the fun. The victim taking the throws. The charge for death right now. Lumen up a game. Up a game, but no, he's going to be checked. Oh, my God. The victim, you got to do something, man. Show that you a fella. Oh, no. The entire OD for the plus frame oh, backs up. Oh, I had him, but then you know, got the words. More plus frames, though. They get turn. Oh! Sweep off the feet. It's so hard to fight Lily. She gets to be watching her stocks. Yes. Yeah. To know when she's plus and when she's, she's not. In some ranges, she still might be plus, you know, yeah. depending on what happens. I will say the uh, Convictor's DI has been pretty good. It's not been countered anything like that, but oh, wait a second. Plus frames, but no confirm. It's looking so bad. One bar each side, though. Drive gauge is looking a little half and half on each end. Avoid the pepper fairy. fairy. No follow up. I, I don't think Convict is ready for five though. That's what I'm saying here. Oh, it's a nerve. It's a nerve, it's a nerve, it's a nerve man. 
can't no. stock up for free. Easily jumped in on the command jump. Jamidi kick gets the hit. Lumen sitting on set point. Drive rush medium starter. Mines fast. Command grab off the minus frames. Actually, that was plus. That was the overhead. What are we talking about? We don't care. Oh, and that's SPD. You drive rush. And this time, you're going to stop. Oh, man, so we leveling up. And right through the S last show. Okay, let's go, let's go. Exactly. That's what I'm talking about. Difficult fireballs. Mm. Damn, there they are right there. Drop them right back down to the ground. Go or die. And waited for DP that time for Victor because he saw realized like every other time that he has gone for the DP after the plus frames. That crush? Oh, not close enough. But wait, what? Another air flat? Jesus Christ. DP right after. Ooh. The command grab off the stand light kick. Still in the game. I'm fucking Victor. I didn't mean to disrespect you like that. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Get that bar stocked up. That's going in right now. You have to have that switch at the very end. Sometimes you stock up, you back up. Sometimes you go in. Wake up, SBD. Grown One man team. Just like, if you get close. You get too close. Oh, wait a second. You get too close to a punish counter. I'm going to drive rush in, and the pressure is going to be on. Lumen. Wall sweep. Just sweep after that. Oh, Face out the no. DP. You spin the punish counter. Oh, no. OD right after. The next hit will kill. Oh no, that could have been really the fire drive for us, but what's what? Plus frames and. No oh, time again, that could have been. Level three. Too close! <laughs> You're too close! The OD for the kill! Ooh. Convicted of command grabs. That's a felony, you see. Oh yeah, that's what he is. He's gonna serve some time behind bars. But that's why you're at the military base, because you gotta serve him uh, in the Air Force after that. Oh my god, and speaking of the Air Force, the Take body splash to start off? Whew. Continuously. Air stock up, OD with Gondor's fire, mm. DP right after. Oh, she a demon. Oh, she with that wind stock, oh. drive, impact. It is a smart option to DJ. Well, I was about to drop the pack room. Nice pick up to put him down. Oh, One more hit will be a command grab. It will be a stand light kick. A perfect KO. Convicted of fun. Convicted of quarter pressure. Oh, Continuously. Man. She meant to do that indeed. Convicted is looking like he is up right now. Answering back with a P and looking like he changed the whole tone of the set. All right, you just have some trouble right now. Lumen, I'm going to need you to wake up. Otherwise, this woman's going to take you out in front of all the men at the airport. Guy was back there, bro. He ain't going to let you live this down. I was like, listen, wouldn't happen to me, though. Just Could saying, be me. Personally, wouldn't let this happen to me. In the corner, stocks up, stand light kick. There's the DP as an entire choice. Which will jump, heavy kick. Make the box it out. Got to oh, get, take the turn back. Careful now. You disrespect though. You know, you can't always just let them get away with plus frames. You gotta challenge the times. You can't just let yourself be conditioned in the wise words of Yikes. You gotta be shampoo, okay? You gotta be shampoo. Damn, it is wise. Careful now. The fireball's coming through. Might be wind clad right through. Oh, oh super one. one. It didn't get. Oh, that was. I thought it was actually going to be able to land. You it. No. You, you had the chance. chance. You had the opportunity. It was in your hands. Oh, no, it's good though, dude. His butterfingers. And now you gotta get stepped on the death again, please don't. Do you bait it out? Did we bait? Time to decimate. Crouch Never no mind. mind. It's too much spaghetti on the floor. Eminem, we're having a field day right now. This is not okay, okay? What if you could like drive rush right after that crouch here? I feel maybe. like you could have. Like maybe like you maybe didn't have the charge with DP, maybe too far out. Drive rush up for the grip, and that is it. Final game, final round. The pick to the fun. Will he be part of the bracket and have to struggle with his duties or is he going back? To uh, T.O. Wing. We'll find out in this next episode of Dragon Ball Z. When the next 90 seconds, episode, by the way. Oh my god, the overhead dun, coming dun, through. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Step on her. That was better uh, sound effect. It's the turn. Except in the corner. Area oh. right there. Here's a pickup. Beautiful pickup, actually. Wake up, BP. Oh, you did. What? But you get the fourth knock down the other side. What? No fear to jump in against this character. Whoa, 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 whoa. Two piece into the super. Mm. Okay, Lumen. Yeah, you see him back it off. You know, he, it's funny because if he doesn't drop this combo, he can actually kill him. Oh, no, yeah, he's dead. This is not okay. Take him into the ride. Get that level three off. Wait. Cut or dive. Risky option, but it pays off. It is minus. But it works out. Black. Let's it loose to the OD. Oh, he he's out the DP. And you're not it this time. No, you are not convicted of fun, showing why he's having a good time out here. And then she gets Oki off of that. She meet her with something. It's power. It's just good. Like, it, it's the way she plays around. It's, it's, this matchup is really dependent on how the Kami player uses their crouch to do and how the key player can test with it. Like, it, it, that's all it's going to be. Mm -hmm. Nice jab, check it through immediate FD. Okay, Bob. What should be building? 
damage. Neutral jump. Ooh. Command grab here too close once again. Bad situation. Bob willing away gets a sweep off the feet. Mothman. Mm. Need to wake up real quick. Try it again. That didn't even combo. He was just pressing his button. That's a counter. Yeah. Try to hit him. Try to take like a ton of dodge. Comes through. Punish counter. Strong arrow. Attack on the throw. Get off me. Oh, his level one did get buffed too, so uh, that could that could play a little faction, you know. Could be. It could. I mean, in terms of more consistency for the conversions. Oh, that command oh, grab. I didn't know. I thought that was the a light. That was definitely was not. He died. Jesus, her neck. Even like when you see like a raw SVD, because like, that's his damage point. He wants damage off that SVD. It's still insane that he does that much to the drive mm. impact right back. Even this early, you. it's 11.34 people reacting to drive impact. That's crazy. Oh, yeah. OD. They had the coffee in the morning. Indeed, the caffeine is working overtime. Oh, we've got some times. She's getting to that now and get burnt out. And how's not looking too good? A big man like you being Ashley in the corner is not a good look against this woman. God damn, get the jerkins. Drive impact. Jump, fear, starter. He doesn't have to level two for that victory. They level one or level two. Yeah, but level one is enough. Just at the very tip to do it. With that kill. Mothman saves that box. Four level three later on in this final round. But at the same time, a level three on Geek. Final round, also dangerous. No command grab too far out. The distance when you hugging your demons. And you lucky you didn't get punished for that. The counter fire into the roundhouse to make sure you get that whip punish and that heavy damage. Right now, Mothman is looking really powerful controlling the neutral. But however, you know how quickly the neutral could change when he gets that command grab coming through. There's no way you threw out that overhead like that, brother. What? Let it rip in the corner. We DP in the tray. You still have a coffee in the corner. This is where you want her. Nice Not able to run around. No real estate to run. He has level three. Don't don't let him do it, my loyal fans. By all means, please don't. Sweep up in the corner. Oh, oh back. We out man! Of here. Nice tech on the throw. Drive gauge looking a little, uh, a little down for both players, but right now, fighting back in the corner. Oh my God! Jump back, jump back, PP. Yeah, paid out these reactions. Puts himself in front. Maybe doing like a preemptive parry. Not the worst. Not the best idea. To mm. the man grab. He can get in the yellow. Never mind, let's put the level three right now. We'll kill, but we'll put them in a guest for game scenario. But as you said before, look at that bar at the bottom of the side of Geeb. Now CA, so you die if you get gripped. Don't get gripped, please. My loyal fans. Oh, my God. Honeyford. My loyal oh, fans. We hold the north and not go south. Yeah, please. That's mm. CA. I'm not trying to see that cutscene. Yeah, we're in Florida right now, but sometimes we like to go to the North Pole, okay? We want to see Santa. Let's see Santa. Let's see Santa. Oh. The DP for good. Whoa, that was a size 20 coming to your face. I'll be terrified too, brother. We'll see you press the button. I don't know why. You missed that. You keep players to take that jump in early stages just to get that pressure. You don't have the driver's distance. You don't have the dash up. It makes sense. Take risks. Oh, oh, big jump jump like oh, this is not looking too good. Mothman is having the time of his life in this corner. He's styling. Golly. I didn't even see that come before in my life. Oh, here's the back throw, though. Did he see? He's got the bar at the bottom, too, as well, for some extensions. Mothman undeterred right now, unafraid. He's not, but don't get thrown. Yeah, I like that. That just is a great tip. Set heavy kick. Very good poke tool. If they tried to go for a stand medium punch, they would have got blessed, so. Good stuff, Mothman. Final round for him, I should say. Yeah, Bobby's been throwing out that crowd uh, punch a lot, and that's why he's been throwing out that round to try to contest with him. He was at OEVP as well, too. Mm -hmm. Really nice side switch, too. Mothman. Looking real good. Bar getting off both at the bottom. Mm, train of, whoa, wake up SPD. I like these things. Shaved the last game, actually. They try to go for the air SPD. Didn't work out. The jump back, light kick, saves the day. Too far. There's a fat hurt box on the dive kick. Mm -hmm. Oh, it gets, oh no, got the cross up. He puts the corner. You actually can die. You can die from crowd to medium kick. Don't do it. Got the bar at the bottom. You need to be in the green for the Don't right sort of extension. It. A little more help than the usual. You will die from a crowd team. You kick the all. Oh, oh yes, my God, the man. Again. And that should be enough to see a see this cutscene. Oh my God! Just put the legs around Zangief and say, you know what? Execute. He's gone. That's the best way to die. Oh, for real? Yeah. What? As RJ would say, uh, do that to me. Do that that to you. Do so. So we have Blanca versus Kimberly on deck. This man, Blanca, yeah. the hype. Why is he doing so many flips going onto the stage? Settle down. Let's see a lot of this, this matchup. The block of balls, air block of balls, and things like that. See that continuing to lose character. And more importantly, Jim Bailey. Doesn't like to stay on the ground too much. He does not. One thing I love about Blanca plays, just in general, with a lot of people, is like, you, I like to see how each Blanca uses the Blanca channel. 
And mm. some blockers like straight up will actually throw out the block chain just to see how you react to it to determine how they're gonna play the matchup. And just, but Jimmy Lee doesn't care. He's definitely going for like uh, <laughs> being in your face and doing some uh, cheeky stuff with the command grab. That's true. The jump in, try brush, and burn out. Already looking at Ashley. Careful now. Drive impact. That's why I immediately took advantage of the fact that he has no drive bar. So <gasps> impact with OD right back. Dang, he's with the ODDP. The bird of the world was not enough. That's a crunchy beam kick. It's a counter. No big follow up though. Initial B. I'm going to need to take the initiative. Try take him out. OD. Drive brush right after the neutral jump. The perfect carry for defense. Entire option on deck. Throw. So adding up. Oh, wait a second. You try to press some down. There's no big punish counter. Drop the line DM. She don't want to talk to you about guy. Oh, the counter DI. Should you not drop this combo, you have the meter to kill him. The solo two. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. All day, every day. That's how we play. This will be. Starts off initially great. Let's see what happens, though. Jabili, as you pointed out, wasn't able to get too many of those walker dolls off. Like, no, no like, real knockdowns to get the walker to land. Let's see what happens. Balls up the throw. Old store to make this man go south. Pick it to the Tatsu. The can. The can. Still right there. You tried to go through it. No, sir. Look at this. Get Zuna drop into the corner, and there's a mix coming through. Are we holding North now? Pressure for real. Beautiful punish. Jabili trying to start his offense, but right now, initial B. The teleport, Lord, the in and out move, the fake out, the extra damage. My man was holding Barry. OD, back up, looking for the OD. Now he's glimpsed off and burnout. This will be looking for that slot fly. Oh, both players are asking right oh now, but this man, Lord, we Lord. are jumping. Freaky frogs out here. No super is not going to land. At least he gets, uh, he gets a bump, so that's fine. Backing off. Oh, he has his land. Oh, oh the expert can is not enough. Watch out for the throw, please. The command grab is definitely going to come through. <gasps> he jumps there. back. Oh, oh no! That could have been a punish initial B. Shakes the same. He's like, man, thank God that man didn't do nothing to be old. <laughs> thank God. My goodness. Look at the deep breath he's out. I don't know how I got out of that alive. That's the way it should be. If you make a mistake, and you see that you made a mistake, you should be like, all right, even if I won that round, I should be like, okay, I need to be better next time. I need to be better next time. You really also have to worry about being burnt. Corner to throw. Oh, he's taking a bite out this woman. I feel you, but like. Yes. Locking back in. Jabali taking that round. Oh, what a peep at that. I haven't seen too much Blocker Chan as recently. I feel like he hasn't had a chance to actually set up Blocker Chan because of how much initial B has been moving. But wait, the balls are on deck and the Blocker Balls are out here. And you need like a knockdown, right? You need yeah. something like sizable. You want to do it wrong with the neutral? I guess it's kind of careful. Look at that. No yeah. side will prevent that from happening continuously. So you got to be careful. Walk mm -hmm. up, though, against the preemptive fairy. Calls it out. Get some extra damage on that grip. Go out of there. Side switch. GP. Block a ball. I should say for the follow up. Oh, jumping back, calling out the slide. Wait, he's standing down, bro. He charged that jump up. You saw that was like a freak. <laughs> he said, what? He made it. I don't know if you hear it. He said, what? That was the loudest one I've ever seen. But hey, right now, this says, he, he's saying, don't make me angry. A chip is going to be the really? issue. Man, you, that what was so loud. He's like, how did I miss that DP? Making excuses already. Oh, my hands are tired. My hands are cold. You know he hasn't built in OS at all times. Yeah, 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 of course, of course. I didn't get enough sleep. I slept on the wrong side of the bed, you know? Yeah. I woke up and my uh, left sock wasn't on, so you know that's a bad thing. My picture. left sock? Not the right sock? Nah. Left sock? Left sock wasn't on. You know he's left handed. I didn't know that. I didn't know that he's on the line. <laughs> but <laughs> the blocker so. balls are coming through, okay? <laughs> wow. You gotta be left handed if you're playing blocker. This character's strange. He is very weird. He's a weirdo to play the character. Ooh, that was a great confirm with the jump back. Oh, oh, the lot. And wait a second, we pressed some batons. Quite a bit. Damn near every single one on the stick. Initial B trying to get in. Now with burnout. Really harassing continuously. Side switch gets the mix, and that's it. Jabili on set point. Initial B, I need you to take the initiative. I need you to lean forward at a 45 degree angle and take it, okay? Is it 45 degrees? You gotta be 45 degrees, you know? Is it the shrimp angle? What's the official angle, Chad? Let me know. Is it 45 or like 90? 90? Yeah, you got 90. You, that's the best posture in FGC. Oh, yeah, 90 is like straight up. Yeah, you know, nice and deep. See the TK block the ball in play, aerial option, the side switch, back throw, but burnout may not matter if you get that level two off. You haven't seen it being activated, or maybe he'll go for level three. I don't think he's going to get none of that activated right now. He's getting his small on, now he's making him angry. Oh my god, level two install. You got to watch out. Jump back yeah. again. Two slides. Yeah, I might just call it time of death. There it is, the throw. Should be enough to do it. Jabaley saying whatever he's saying. He I don't know if it's sucks. excuses. 
He said something sucks. Though. I, I definitely said. I definitely heard something sucks. Better not be the sucks. other person. I would not come back if if the To came and played. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Make your face. Make your face. Make your face. If you try to leave. A little recovery on the landing. Yeah. But overall, he is still. He's still looking. Good. He hits what's going to hurt. This matchup, not too good for Honda. Look at that. Whoa. Walk back, got the suppressor punish. That was fantastic. You can tell this person plays a lot of Honda. Oh, yeah. Butter punch. He's definitely going to be playing the space game right now. He knows that Honda has to come to him in most cases so he can just wait. And especially, he's going to get a read of that perfect parry. Yeah. You can tell he's going to get a read of that perfect parry. You also have to watch out for, like, if you go for butt slam, you charge fears. Luke has an easy way to challenge that. He's in. Slam lands. Oh, no, his toes got stuck on That's about, like, size 20. Don't do that. Oh, oh my the God. Oh, fake out. Man. The same fears. Impact and right the back. He recovers. EI, all that work for nothing. He was so strong in the beginning in the first half. But the 1,000-man slap coming through Honda being hype and look at look at my skin Nick Fury out there in the background saying yeah Honda get him get him get him get him the headbutt off way to kiss stock him the heavenly hands praises the sun oh that's not looking too good right now I don't even know where the sunlight came from this place is dark as hell oh, like this in that area Stan Fears oh no. right after the three piece right much medium Oh, he did it. The ball parade. No, Let it rip. Don't get command grab, please, because it's not going to be too good for you in the corner. It's not going to be good at all. Oh, she can hold parry. <laughs> oh, she the stand fear. Ah, that's going to be. Oh, no, he dropped it. That's going to be a punish. You missed the punish. You just get a throw instead. That's a Chicago punish. We in Tampa. What are you doing? Let's show a bandage. Actually, find this game. This is going to to work out. Time to go to work. Oh, this is me. Yeah. Come up. Oh, no Memphis. God, this is CA. Y'all just watch this man get a beat down? It's crazy. Don't wake up a little bit. Oh my You'll god. Going there. Drive, impact, no reaction right back. What if it's about to die? You didn't spend it? Oh man, you are a brave man. Yeah, but we could have spent OD in that sequence at some point, but either way, next round. Next round, okay. What if it's still level three on their side? No bar at the bottom here for Butter Punch. I think they don't need it in this, man. They already have Ooh. level one stocked up. Perfect parry, the light knuckle heavy ender. Love to see it. They got the OKL for this. Jumping over the head, but once again, he's praising the sun. The sun is coming around him, but wait a second. This is a grown man, a sumo wrestler, coming to you full speed, but wait a second. Spine Buster. He fireball. Going to nothing. No parry. Oh, yes. Oh, no. Crouch Fierce. I'm surprised. No, uh, Butter Punch side of things. Crouch Fierce, easy answer against Mud Slam. Maybe it doesn't hang the mouse play yet. Oh, trying to perfect parry his death. Oh, wait a second, the suppressor. But nothing help of it though. The anti air with the headbutt and a command grab to scoop the BBL coming down. Nah, get him on. The what? The BBL, brother. Perfect parry. All that big stuff in the bottom. Ooh. The throw right there. Got the bar. He's almost no, he, got level three. Yo, oh no. How the butter almost get level wait, three? Yo. Huh? And he didn't do level three right back at you. Jump oh no. Fears. Hey, it's looking scary right now. Big jump, and that should be a confirm into level three this time around. It's time to go to work, and guess what? We got a ticket. Where's it going to, say? Memphis! Not bad. We're going to see the Grizzlies, man, okay? John Moran's back on the season. Oh, never mind, he got injured. I heard there's good barbecue out there. Probably is. Yeah, yeah. It's, 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 it's basically the South. Is it really? It's basically the South, yeah. yeah. It's the South. But I, I, I gotta taste it, so if you're in Memphis area, please let me know. Let's go to your area. The perfect parry is there. So it's good against this matchup. Perfect parry against Headbutt. Ready and steady to deal with that option. My man did raw palm parade. Oh. Doesn't count the perfect parry. Once again, oh, he's gonna read. Up. Oh, he didn't oh, He didn't get the perfect one. Oh, last knuckle. Go for the legs and nothing not the words. Man, Headbutt's really minus four. Same thing. The fact that, like, it's based up, you can't do anything about it. Yes. Real nasty. Except for that perfect parry preemptively. Scale damage. You just try to push him back. This is also putting the theory, uh, fear in your mind because, yeah, it's scale damage, but it's damage uh, nonetheless. So you got to be careful. Can't take it off the table, too, if you're uh, on the bridge. Except for if you put in the smart. So we got the perfect thing. That's uh, whole perfect combo. Yeah, okay, okay. okay. Dash up, medium kick. We'll take that trade. It's butter punch. Oh, he knocks him down to the ground. The butt stuff. Stan Fierce, yeah, fits the face. Oh, they get the end of no way. This is bad. This is bad. Don't let him come back. Don't let him come back and watch your toes. For the U. Can you burn out, but the trade had more than enough health for that transaction. Butter punch. Final round. Oh, Spine Buster with OD going to the corner right now. Oh, spinning the OD. He does not care about burnout. Because that's what you exactly you are. You grade up. Man, it's not looking too good. All this is, oh my god. Sweaty palms being plus is insane. 
Careful now. Level three at the side. What a bunch of see that oh, breaking no. from the corner. Oh, oh no, another BBL drop. Please make it stop. Oh my god. Dr. Miami did too much work and now he's coming to Tampa to take him out. No. Darks in the sky. No surprise, one man. If he's not stopping the mud stuff, he's gonna keep doing it while you see a perfect carry. Oh, that full is really with the scaling. I guess he's aiming for the drop gauge, but a lot of bar to spin right now. No scaling the drop gauge. But that's I mean, barely 25. Bro, that's not. Usually it's like happy health. Yeah. You know, Memphis is, is, a, is a long trip. <laughs> a lot of damage. A lot of damage. To the wallet. Up in the corner. Take a throw. He put him in the corner. If you can put the camera in the corner, it's good work to drive impact against spinning back fist. The stomp. Well, we haven't seen Obey come through at all. Impact, right back. No. No, he doesn't get it. You spin the CA this time around? No, he's not. Oh, wait. This is bad. This is so bad. Up. It's got that level three. See, I should say. It's been just yet one more interaction I think he's looking for. No oh, anti -air, no. But it was a counter hit. Headbutt. I'm not sure. Didn't do level one, but he can react to it any. Uh, oh, he might react to headbutt with level one. You better not do it. He also go for that chip as well. There it is. A fireball to make him fall. Butter punch. Moving on. Little fight. He's a grinder. All right. He's a grinder. He's just be out here showing off the work at all times. Kevin two times knows what he's doing. Dual Kevin is on the screen. But hey, don't count out convicted. We just mm -hmm. saw him make the comeback over the DJ with the Lily earlier today. But you're going to get the tip of type of he's being loose. You know what Luke has? Sandblast from very big forearms. You need to stay back, bro. Like, I don't know what you got. I don't know what you're taking, but like, please fix your arms. Man said, what does he have? Everything. He's very blessed. He's privileged. He's very privileged indeed. He is a manifest destiny. Like, no one talks about this man walking around barefoot everywhere. Like, that is nasty work. Would bro. you say something to that man? He came up to you in your shop? Barefooted? Yeah. yeah. Get out my shop. Trippers out? Yeah. No, you would. Not with the fist out, bro. No, yes, I would. Yours are kind of similar, but no. Nah, nah. nah. I think he might surpass you. Me personally, I don't fear no man who bleeds. But wait a second. I do fear this man with all the drive gauge on the side. Because he can do some damage. Oh, oh yeah. no. This is what I'm talking about. Oh, God. Take don't get wrong. Well, don't matter to him. He's just looking for Plus. one certain option. I mean, honestly, he's looking for like one good crushing medium punch into like a knuckle. So what you, that's all you really need to stand here. So this point might be one fireball. Charge up. Plus, and goes for the DI. Wait a minute, convicted. Show this man you're having fun. It's not over. It's not over. Oh, DDP on the walk up, bro. On this man's wake up. Yeah, sometimes you just gotta do. You gotta show him like, yo, I know you think you're about to happen, but I got a DP coming in though. Oh, big jump for the second. That's a perfect. And this is so much damage to get pushed to the corner. He has level three on deck. Are you going to choose suspender right now, Duel Kevin? Are you? There's no reason not to, right? Oh, yes, sir. It's not going to kill, but this is going to be some damage. Did I lie to y'all? Did I lie to y'all? Brother, it's not going to kill? It's not going to kill. Tento, do you see that character on the screen? Do you see who's on the box art? This man took his finish for real. I wonder why his forearms are <laughs> like <laughs> Jesus Christ. She's dead. In front of all the people, too. You can just watch this little lady just get killed by this man with no shoes on, bro. Help her. Harry. No back throw, though. I'm surprised it wasn't a switching position. But do Kevin. It's all, I can drive reversal. You know, it's not bad, even though she's got more meter than you, but you want to keep him caught in the corner. It makes them waste that wind sock when you're that close. You get harassed and prevent that from happening again. Target combo on deck coming out of dual camera. He is harassing this woman in the corner. She has to get out right now. Kevin is playing in that, that neutral range with that low forward. It's going to hit. I was just about to say, watch your toes. He's literally so tearing and tottering right out of the range of low forward in the corner. And he is waiting for his moment for you to stand up and him to get the kill. Nice. Against the wall, man. Where are you going to go? And I like that Kevin's watching her in a little bit. But here we go. Confirm. Really yeah. They're in the super, and OD is spent just yet. OD is spent for the side of just uh, uh, Duke Heaven. Drive rush medium. Oh, he's going in there indeed. My god, the perfect left once again. He's going to move too bad. Oh, he just finished up the screen. This ain't good. The frame kill, crash the medium punch. Dog punch is on fun. A lot more on the kid. Left on three. Tinta, will this kill? You know, I'm kill? not going to beat James oh, this time. He's level, level two instead because he doesn't want to see the whole animation. He just wants to stay in well, beast mode, baby. Okay. I just want to know. I just want to know. <laughs> Dual Kevin smiling. Luke. Because he plays Luke. <laughs> yeah. And Convicted smiling because he's like, you know what? I'm just going to get the literal Luke dude that was at Capcom Cup Top 16. You so I guess he did a pretty good job in the C tournament. He understands how to play against Honda. And in fact, I feel like 
when Honda dropped me, it was one of the more positive people about fighting that character, knowing what options to take after minus four headbutt. He's like, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, I don't get the strike back, but what button choice I do is surpass their button choice too. So even when this Honda, this Honda character was uh, ruling the, the tier list and uh, the angry Ooh. people, he did not have an anti right there. What's going on, Jack? Yeah, he's not having anti at all. But yeah, another thing too, you talk about the minus four situation. Well, I see Jack do a lot of times. He just simply reacts to headbutt with DP. That's true. He will do that too as well. You might have to see like a fake out coming through, like maybe like a like headbutt. Right. Kill right with a perfect KO. Strider. We talking him up, but he getting cooked evenly on the grill, bro. Jack, you're not showing the moisture. Bro, we see the anti come from Strider. Though. We see the OD bar. Oh, let me find out. We see a big upset already. Jack being down to lose. Crowd you know, in the hands of follow the OD lands right after stock up heavily hands of the left. Yeah, we ain't seeing no, we ain't gonna see no, I don't think we're gonna see an upset, but I was a little crazy. I'm about to see a double P, but right now he's dead, by the way. That's level three being spent. Oh my god, the ring of fire. Hello, what is going on? What's happened? The ring of fire, that's what's happening, okay. Jack is getting caught. Shark bait. He uh, is getting those cheeks caught. Shark bait. Uh, what is going? He should know this matchup. He's playing so many Honda players. You know, we, we have Cool Man. We have Ramsey. Try to say you ain't know about me, though. Oh, oh my. again as an anti choice. Working. Drive rush throw. Jerry's getting free hugs. Oh, Perfect. wait a Perry second. Back yeah, step the on the back. It's not so fun, is it? Okay? It's not so fun, is it? It no, feels so fun. Oh, we can push to the corner. You gotta watch out. Yeah, can be inbound. Stock it up. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nice technique, bro. No perfect parry this time around, but a big jump and beautiful anti with the crouching fierce. But wait a second, you got caught. Say too good, and now you grabbing nothing but air. There's nothing but cast from his uncle's right there. The meaty with the low. <gasps> no, this is not okay. This ain't good. Jack, this could be bad for you. He's gonna get the moment the back of his hands to get the side switch. Oh! Drive rush, command grab. The damage to as well. DP, Jack's right? almost dead. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Watch where out the DP's at? Tinto, you said there were DP's. I was saying DP's. Oh, oh no. Oh, this is the overhead. Bro. bro. Jesus Christ. Are we going to see We gonna see this man Jack go down 2-0 immediately and win the side of his pools? It could be. It actually could be. DP pick up. The corner. Foot dive. Foot dive is going to be inbound. But wait a second. His feet on deck. The foot and George are having a good time. Honda, oh he's rejoicing because he's in the corner dealing with this. Oh, no. That's not where you want to be as Honda, right? You're going to be caught in the corner. He dies to throw continuously. Can't reversal. Has to super. Jack has to make the most of this. You have to put a position. Oh my god. Interruption. That could be so much worse. Nice the challenge. Train. Yo, Strider has been challenging correctly. I will say that, but that's going to be a big punish. punish. All right, Jack. Rounding it back. There we go. That was the first round he took, by the way. <laughs> that's crazy to say. That's the first round Jack has taken. Nice. He gets a DP right after. He misses the normal. No big deal. Catches the jump back. Drive rush into the grip. Oh, he ran up for a minute. All the grippers. Oh my gosh, the ODB. Oh, ODB headbutt is so good. It is so good. But it can't be pulled by throws. So Jack has to get more throws. So he's, uh, he's he does the Ooh, knockdown. Ooh, that wasn't even punished. He's a corner not watching his toe. And that's going to be a boom sway install. And we're in the corner. What's the setup after this? Oh, step on him. Feet installed. Step on him. Feet picks installed. No, feet picks and installed indeed. And guess what? You subscribe to the OnlyFans. And that's why you get the good trip to the dry gauge. And all of you. It's gone. The light is gone. Ooh, Jack <laughs> back in business. He paid for the OnlyFans through his life. That is insane. <laughs> Sir, you don't have enough for this transaction. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the only fans, the only hands. We'll see what happens. Jack, Strider, final game between the two. Will we see an upset? It's Jack. Let's push to the brink already. This is Pools. When is Pools? When is Pools at that? But it shows you how stiff the competition is at all times. You have to be ready for anybody to come on deck and make you say, oh, wait a minute. I got to play, play my A game at all times. Yeah, yeah. Which means like any Honda player playing this character right now, probably damn good for the perfect parries, or even better, some kind of days. As Jack would say, look at that. Medium with the stand, medium punch. Mm. Harass, continue throwing bows. And Jack, set point. That medium punch being plus two is insane, brother. That's definitely now again, the corner pressure is not where you want to be. Honda can't really do too much he can't on defense. All. He's harassing, he is holding down back. Me personally, I would not pay to come to this event, fly out here, and use my controller to hold down back the entire time. I'm pressing the damn button, but Jack is playing the person the right button right now. And this man is ashy! Did not 
see that he was out of drive gate. Feng Spay engine activated once again. Corner carry. Beat.exe. Yeah, that's a GG. Book die, book die. Oh, too far out. Drive brush. The mm. ring pump takes it. That is it. Jack. The moist one. Moving on. He said, oh, I had to know. That was kind of close. I'm yeah. Like, Why was that close, Jack? He said, I didn't Why know. Why was it? He was talking all that mess on Twitter. Oh, oh, oh. oh. This guy yeah, is good. Yeah, it's you. He said, this guy yeah, is good, Yeah, this guy is good. It's a scary Absolute, blocker, bro. It, it, it's, it's a threat, bro. Problem X, Flash. People like this, Mena RD. You can choose when to play solid and when to play ass. But now with JP, though, the cross going back. Original main. So I think this matchup actually got worse. In fact, that, you know, aerial force can be harder to deal with. You don't have to crouch here. You rely upon five kick hit. In the corner, carry half. Oh, already. no. Oh, no. Now it's oh. Jimmy. Oh, no. Crouch here. All the way in. Stocks up. Meaty fire up on right oh, now. Oh, no. The DP enter solo. Making this a solo interaction right now. Single player only unleash. Controller, my friend, you're not able to play. Solo, really quickly taking down Kip Ross in the first round. Bro, he did it like when you know, you got a little cousin come through and you're like, oh yeah, we can play the game two players. He's and like, you're <laughs> six. Oh, that's exactly what happened right there. Oh, that man, was perfect. Yeah, bro, you're having fun with me. Yeah, yeah. Let's go, bro. Huh? Yeah. All right, wait a second, though. I'm trying to put you in, but guess what? I don't have anti airs anymore. Yes, you do. You have four heavy four roundhouse, okay? You four have air throw. Four roundhouse is really good, bro. People be forgetting that he has air throw. And also, Contrius isn't bad. It's just not as good as it used to be. Kip off, still on the ground, though. Pierce right after, sets up the departure. <gasps> nice. Couldn't get, get it, though. Pick up, though. That was such a good Goodness. option. Because the fireball, that drive rush, if you want to do that, the overhead this time, box it up fine. Perfect area. Carry. And not going to be the kill because that's going to be scale damage. But burnout, and you know what JP is, he's still the best character of the game when you're in burnout. Why? It's too much chip you got to deal with. But letting this woman walk you down like this is the thing. There we go. Back in the punch. Gets the OD ghost right after. Gets cross. Routes it back. Fun around between the two. Definitely have to play a lot more of like a zoning game. But it also means you have to be worried about like once you drive rushes in, for but it's always. Oh, and that's a beautiful counter hit confirmed off of the low fireball. Wait a second, though. If he's in the corner, he's ready to press that jab button. You better be aware. Oh, oh no. Drop the low. Level three. Immediately. Get the bar back. Old kill, but it will put them in a beautiful scenario. They can OD fireball to lock JP down. Or they can call it the Amnesia if that's the wake up option. Spot. There's the Amnesia. Finally. Finds the side switch. At least scale, but you just want that additional advantage. That's all you're looking for right here. Oh, and we look for a big counter hit as well. Plus planes on plus planes. So snap your fingers, do your stuff. There's a level two on deck, and it's not looking too good for you. Uh, you weren't blocking correct, but he's only human. Only human. Right now. Take the only about to get that drive oh. impact against a fireball. And the wait, man, the command grab reset. Oh. Bro, I would have thought the level one conversion was about to come through, but no, he said, come it on. Embrace me. The name of it actually is Embrace, which is actually kind of crazy, but that command grab has been a big staple of Kid Frost's gameplay. At that point, you're like, okay, I'll speak for the next interaction. Maybe I won't die for this one. Bam, gripped up. Because that crazy cycle grip. The cycle grip is actually insane. Hey, I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> Getting gripped by a cycle? Yeah. Stay back, bro. Keep the tax collector with me. I already get gripped up by the government. I don't need to get up by the tax collector, too. Man, so the IRS. Man, the IRS is definitely coming for us as of recently. You guys know this already. So be careful. Watch your back. Oh, the Tory grip. Got the uh, auto group grip. Oh, my God. Again, God. you're going to see that continuous drive rush, heavy kick, medium kick. All great options against like, the fireball preemptively at certain ranges. Get a little bit closer to full screen, but that's what we've seen Solo kind of walk in and get that drive rush right after. Mm -hmm. uh, we don't like this thing, don't you? We're going to talk about this thing right now. We're not going to talk about this thing. Fireball drive impact, still able to get. Oh, wait, no. The he departure still hit switch. in the background? I didn't even know. I thought it was already off screen, but guess what? It kind of messed up the combo, but he's still ready for prime time here. Oh, no. This ain't good. This ain't good. This ain't good. The back row. OD fireball puts Kid Frost in front of He raises the fourth frame, gets nothing off it. Stan Fierce, impact, solo, back in business. Back in business, indeed, the right way. Hold on. So, trying to tie this up one to one. He's attempting. It might have. He's got the bar at the bottom too as well for maybe level two. Maybe to equalize things for damage. Dive oh. kick doesn't get it. Oh. It's hit the stand here. You weren't close enough. And that button's still good. Yeah, yeah. Just, you just don't win. You use it the right way. <laughs> you wouldn't really oh, fight again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, people just like to complain, you know. You still have a very strong character here. He has a lot of budget, a lot of cycle energy. And the pimp cane is still putting in overtime. This man can walk just fine. Take away the cane. Oh my god. Heavy kick. Opens him up off the target combo. Level two off the ghastly ghost. Pierce, the backboard. Mm -hmm. 
Go deep to the far sir. Teleport. Oh, oh that was a throw. My oh, bro. God. Kid Ross. Control, alt, delete. And that health bar was definitely deleted. And he's looking like he's about to take this man out. Oh, oh. He fireball the round start too as well. It might happen, bro. See, like the mix is so good with this character. Put him in the blender. Crouch and kick. Drops it low. Mm. Well, and now you got to stay back since the park is on deck. You have a lot of drive games to work with. You got level three as well. But the problem is you got to get close to this man. He's making you stay back. Honestly, at this point, you can actually just block out the marcher, but worry about like that, that next time. See you, losers. Perfect KO inside of Kid Frost. Stay cool, oh, calm, and the collected. Best. Look at him. I'm the best. Where did he was? <laughs> and for mature. E for everyone. E10. Rated S for set. Rated X. We haven't seen that rating in a minute. Oh, we have that. I mean, depending on where you go, you could see it. Let's see if it happens right here between these two. Rated. I think rated. So, yeah, they're all the same. Yeah. Hey, interesting, interesting. We don't see the stretchy lens fellow so much, but he does have home court advantage right now. He's protecting the elephants in the background. So, Manon said, oh, they look cute. And he says, what are you doing here? Get out. And that's why he's trying to defend his own search. They don't appropriate. Yeah, they don't identify. You know what friends do? They like to have those rats. We don't even talk about the rats right now. We're just talking about the beautiful elements in the background. Teleport, get out of there. The fireballs are laid down. Mm. Comet. Anti air. Oh, Yoga Uppercut did not work out. That was a beautiful spacing to call that out. Some of those anti airs are kind of slow. A little more committal, you might think. Good spacing. Oh, out of there. Side switch. Tony has two medals, but it's not looking too good for him right now at all. Yeah. Oh, the overhead. Okay, that slide by the sweep. Tony is also jump. healthy. You have yeah. to jump. Yeah. You can't and jump in those so situations, man, bro. Like, what else can you do when you have no health against Sim? This is where he loves to live, right? Yeah. He's got the lead. He only needs one touch or two touches. And you like panic. So I get over to Sim and try to, you know, do some damage on him. But it's not happening, bro. He's such a strange kid that we don't see him too much often. But, like, some fundamentally, that he's, like, a very hard character to deal with. Fundamentally wise, when it comes to the stuff on paper, but it's just like certain tools that he uh, he has and just doesn't play Street Fighter Six correctly, or any Street Fighter really. He yeah. plays his own game. Maybe he plays it not as well as he did in Fox. He still plays it very well in this game. Fireball layering on the approach. The tech does not connect. Tony takes off, finds a jump in. Oh, the command grab. Try to grab from another right there. Oh my goodness! No confirm off the top. Oh wait a second. We got to drive the person immediately. He doesn't want to deal with him. Stay back. Social distancing. Long distance relations right now. The movie was rated R. You're 13. You can't come in. Oh, we're not. Burnout. Jab, jab. Oh, God. What a fair to burnout. If you're looking for super, also, every so often. Stack and separate. One more hit. Oh, that's chip. chip, but that wasn't. Oh, wait, that was still close enough. Uh, burnout. Was it still safe enough? Actually, probably not. I'm not sure, because really it's only like, what? You know, you get that plus four in burnout. I think that would have been punishable. I don't, mm. I don't remember the exact brain data for that. Uh, I only spent mid edition. But either way, did they take their turn back? Now, even out between these two bar at the bottom for both. Mm. Level three could be the uh, what you see from rated for damage. Only the drop mm. impact, but right back is rated. Rated, he said, I saw that. Everyone did. Okay. Level two immediately attacking out on that damage. Guess what? He just blows. Wait, she got over it? Please do not get gripped right now because it's not looking too good for you at all. I don't mind them saving level one. Level one anti air sequence action is done for the damage. Ooh, I can't be punched right the yoga lance. Yeah, definitely can't jump at this point. Oh, the drive rush. He pulls up. Pulls out a victory right there. Rated with the first one. Looking very locked in right now. Tony, though, not phased. Classic shirt. Had to fix it up straight in just for a second. Mm -hmm. He's going right back in. As he should. You don't have this character the momentum, long no. distance, don't do it. Fireball pressure with the limbs. You got to like read their intentions and maybe try to get a drive impact, get a jump in. Or get a lingering, stay medium punch or anything. But look at how fast it is to get the side switch. And he's actually the oppressor right now. Jump Definitely. here and things like that. Right, it's been staying so strong. But wait a second, Mine's the opening is Tony. And oh my goodness, it's pressing buttons as well. And the overhead is going to seal the deal. Finishing out the trail with the blessing of the head. My God. Hate it. Has to be careful. Another jump in back. Heavy punch. Another kick and grab. Two medals. Drive rush. Look for a grip. It's the turn after it. Another one. Another boot to the face. He's jumping back. And guess what? Coming down with the teleport with some batons. Here, here, right there. Just layering upon layering. Like jump medium. Fireballs. Buttons on the ground. Can Tony get in that mid range? He's trying to avoid it. He's got a big toss. Trade. Tony, get the bar at the bottom. Bro, he's using drive reversal so well to keep her out, and he's been showing the pace so much with it. But right now, Tony, if you find a hit, you actually can win. 
how Raiders understands that is putting up a minefield to try to make sure you can get to it. Oh no. Sweep. Oh no. Feet for that air to air the challenge, Yodi Fireball. Yoga there. uppercut finally works out. That's like the first time I feel like maybe the second time we've seen it work out before. Didn't it was called out. Back to the well. Falls oh, out the sweep. No. Double two. Look at the damage on this thing. Sazara. Oh, he's holding in. He saw him coming in minutes. That can be kick. I mean, laying down a lot of fireballs and limbs up in the corner. Rush down Sims. What we're seeing right now. A reversal Whoa. again. I mean, it makes sense. You've got a reversal, like a real one. So push him back. Optical distance. Avoid the sweep. And it's not looking good for Tony at all. It was like Raiden is going to take it with the yoga lane. Tony while fall and Raiden is going to move on. He said, yo, I'm sorry. You couldn't punch the ticket. The movie for Zeta, are you not old enough? What are, you, are you watching um you watched the, the other show? Wait, what show is it? Oh, Baruto's dad show. What? What do you mean Baruto's dad show? Okay, bro. Moving on. I didn't say Demon Slayer was good. I don't think it's that good. I think Demon Slayer is kind of good. Anyway, let's see if Tong. See, that's his own Tong. Oh my God. Take it. Tong. Please. Not oh, yeah. the BBL drop. Yeah, he's a Honda player. Oh my god, yeah, he's a Honda player for real. <laughs> the OD headbutt off rip. Oh yeah, he's coming in hot. Yeah. He doesn't care. But that butt drop. Oh, he's on the butt drop. Uh -huh. he can't be really? Oh, really? No. Headbutt in the OD headbutt of all things. Sometimes you just gotta do it, just lay it on the table and realize that you ain't scared. But yeah, can't be not scared either. Mr. Boots is definitely having a great time in the corner right now. No TP afterwards all the way. That's why he baited out the grab. There's nothing right to get grabby you. demons. You saw a shadow in the hallway. The demons in the screen with us. Perfect carry spin knuckle. So we're all right after for the Oki trade. Oh yeah. Oh. Conversion ready. And said, you see Mr. Boots definitely ready for these arms. But he's wake up OD. Butt slam. Chunky two for you. Wait a second, the headbutt in the face. Are oh, we saying the praise in the sun? Oh, yeah, we outside with it, so definitely the sun is praise. Time to slide. DP against a jump fierce. Four fierce. Headbutt lands. Oh, oh D caught him walking in a little too confidently. So, man, you so lucky that wasn't fun to counter because that would have been some big damage with level 3 active. Wait a second, pick confirm, and that might just do it. Yes. One more interaction after uh, this. Uh, this uh, uh, that bar. Locked on. Boom. It's alive. One more interaction. One more touch. One throw. A fight. Freeze. A sneeze Ooh. will kill at this point, Tento. Oh, boy. That's a punch counter here. Oh, he couldn't get much off of it, though. I wouldn't have got the heavy kick. Oh, no. That's almost trip guard. Tom oh, Pennington still gets a headbutt. Oh, <laughs> he's blocking in. Shaking the head. He's like, wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. You guys not see what I have on. I'm the whole country. I'm the whole country. You guys must not know who I am. You weren't familiar with my game. You will be very soon. He's got to wake up the Yeah, yeah. I, I think that was either wake up the man grab. Yeah, it was a wake up the man grab. Now I'm just wake up with super. But look at the drive impact. Tong. Now getting clapped. Now arrow for the O key, the super. Trying to get that drive gauge just a little bit right now. He's watching for a throw. Yes, sir. But we tech though. Try to go for a perfect figure, but misses it. The lounge and slaps. Watch out for the board. Trade. Yeah, you're right. That might be the the only DP. You know what? You want to die for that interaction? So it makes sense. It makes sense. You just got to do it. Tong. Locking back in. You know, we still in the alley with it. Start Bro, the start head butt. Got to. I like it. No fear, no fear. He faced yeah. the sun too. Oh, oh yeah. he's out this time. Man, so he plays in the sun. <laughs> you say he plays in the sun or praise the sun? He praises the sun. He praises the sun. I think Honda players play in the sun a little too much. Oh, they do. Excuse me. <laughs> they play too much in general, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Stop headbutting me all the time. You're going to get, get trauma. But again, over and over again. ETE, the headbutt once again. Man. Against the dive kick. They apparently didn't see concussion by Will Smith, but they're going to learn today. <laughs> oh, oh no. again. Do it again, do it again, do it again. Like a super yeah. man. Push back. Get off me. Oh, the, no. Jumping back. We got a butt slam. Try to go for perfect parry, but we got frames on frames. Watch out for the headbutt, and it comes through. Tom waits off the head. He says, hold on. He's all like Listen, all I'm going to say is Mr. Boots lucky. Man's not a lot of bait. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, arrow for the Oki. On tech and continuously on wake up. Oh, this is the lead. Wakes up with the level one. Oh, Whoa! Command grab. <clears throat> BBL action. Immediately gets the grip. Oh, nice DP. Mr. Boots. Tech on the throw. Counter hit. By oh, something no, from but the command grab. Come off the low for Kajami. Mm. Did he crush fears? He flips out. Don't get hit, don't get hit, don't get hit, don't get hit. 
What side? I mean, anybody could die. Yeah. Any interaction? Oh, wait the a jump second. back with the ODDD. The butt slam lands. And, and the command, command grab. Oh, stays alive by gripping the man's up. Man. Huh? Oh, yeah. No <laughs> oh, oh, giving oh. The boots. oh, oh, oh. Yeah, okay, okay. No ball. I never box. <laughs> I mean what I say. Grip him. to play all day. Grip him. <laughs> Headbutt gets the knockdown, stocks up the heavy hand to get the attention. Mm. Only keep immediately gets his uh, jump is but he puts up in the corner. Not where you want to be, even if you are having one of the better reversals in the game. So no side switch, he didn't go back throw. Oh, another butt slam. Oh, wait, gets the back throw this time around. Wait a minute. Trying to jump this man out of his socks. Wait a second, good DP. Mr. Moose's DP has been very good for some oh. arrow. He took the pressure, drops it low. And that was me enough, and that should be the gift. Oh, no. People no. be able to be missing now. You want it. No, the drop. You, you want it. You had it. Now you're burned oh, out. Oh, my God. I positive he could have spent a little bit more drive gauge into level one. He could have had a better time. But Mr. Boots, now you have him face against Kong being on set point. He's bringing it back to the Hokage, showing his ninja way. His ninja way is too strong. Hold on, Mr. Boots. Wait, wakes up uh. into the super after the jab count. Uh. Oh, my oh, God. Lord. My man don't got no help, no gauge to his name. The DC is there, though. The oh interpreter will make up OZ. I'll crazy, tell you one son. thing. Playing Tong is frustrating as how you can see it, Mr. Boots. For the OZ! Tong taking out Mr. Boots and just playing his own game, bro. Okage playing his own game. I always want to see them come out and be like, you know what? It's time. But we have Luke going against Rashid. Luke's so strong. I think this matchup got better. It wasn't fun before, but now you have an actual like anti-air, which is OD mixer. Like that's a real anti-air just like a jump. If it's been bar, yeah, I get it, but you can back up for the heavy mixer works out. But if he's coming through jump fears, oh, it's early, plus. OD will definitely work out. Corner carry, charge a fireball. It's plus. No reversal this time, but he takes the throw. Oh, oh look at that. Oh. The pickup. Yo, that medium punch. Is so good. Okay, Gal. I see you. Those two people are beautiful taking the throw. Yep. Oh, Fireball's definitely problematic. Slides underneath. Actually, was able to get that off. Wasn't even sliding. He gets a fireball. Oh, Does it again. Go for the toes. Oh, oh, man, oh no. Oh, he almost got it, but the throw. No, he gets counter hit instead. Does not finish the combo. And he goes for the DI, but you do not have the health to take it. That was looking at flawless. I mean, perfect. Sorry. <laughs> oh, hold on now. Gallant. Come out. He's fireball. What do you do? There's a call for fireball. He almost got the pickup right there. Maybe for a medium punch would have been better. Get the first combo. Aqua. What you got here? Just a little jab confirm. Okay, okay, okay. Just kind of hit. Like the wind storm. Oh, yeah, the wind condition is up, but it's not, it's not a good one either. It's not in Lucas' favor. He's going to send it off. He's going to dash a throw. This is an enhancement, yeah, for the meaty. Plus, oh, it's a back throw. Oh, yeah. That was so good. Yeah. He throws the needle. He'll take like two throws over like getting hit to like 7% of the same Damn, oh, single 7%. Look at the God. awareness. Off the charge of fireball. Over oh, on the throw. It's Gallant. Gallant looking so strong right now, running in and out and making sure he is so pestering with the winds. Look at the man drop the camera. Bro, focus. Focus up, man. Pops it on you. Remember, she's so cool in this game. She's so cool. Acorn hey, looking a little bit lost. He's definitely looking at no play, hey, bro. What, what did I just get hit by, bro? I don't have any notes for Rasheed. Yeah, when know. it comes to, like, high-level Rasheed players, you have Blue Cabin and a handful, but they're really, like, mid for, like, special. Right back, right back! Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Got a little too spicy, my guy. He has a reaction. That's a good thing, but no, he missed the pencil knuckle. Oh. That's not a good sign, bro. You need to get up on that damage. The mixer, the medium version, and now he's going for throwing some more OP. This ain't looking too good. Space out so well. Usually you get blessed, but perfectly done for the side of Gallant. Went hole on that OD gate as much as possible. Slide oh, under. And all that combo, actually. Medium punch again. The mix up off the Arabian Cyclone. Dash oh up. Go Lou. Go DP. Fireball. Man. Fireball. Wait a minute, wait a minute. He's not dropping this time with it. Oh, oh no. he is. Why would you curse him like that, Tinto? You know, I don't curse people. You're just not ready for prime time, apparently. I'm over here commentating. I can't even just touch the stick. That's on you. But he's pressing, oh, he's pressing that medium punch, though. Oh, it's out here. There's OD. Locking down the approach. Gets the cross up. Perfectly done with that jump leading kick. 
Turbos yeah. is on deck, man. JB, I, listen, we all know JB. Cool, Kevin. So, my bad, my bad, my bad. My bad, I'm sorry, Chad. Don't throw JB out there, man. <laughs> hey, JB, I'm going to chat like, hey, yo, they forgot about you when he came to receive, though. He a Jiggy player, what are you talking about? He a Jiggy player, he a Jiggy player. Oh, you're right, you're right. Yeah, he, has, uh, he needs intervention. <laughs> he needs intervention, I'm right, you're right. Oh, that man's trying to run at him, bro. Chill out. We ain't playing football. Football team is over. We'll be immediately with that mixer. Level two, you know what to do. Corner foot. Bro, it's the fact that he might get another. Oh, oh, he was juking. No! Mm -hmm. too obvious on the buffer, my guy. Oh, my God. Look at the damage off this, by the way. Hello? Oh, overhead. It's overhead. It meaty, but it was immediate enough. But he's going to get the throw. He's burnt out, though, but he doesn't care. Why? Because he has footsies. Gallant is going to take it to. Oh, it's awesome. Has been dropping the uh, pitch. Uh, you know, you don't understand how long my pencil is on Twitter. Huh? Yeah, I'll, I'll drop a picture. You think I have a read you on uh, some That's guys and stuff? crazy work that you mute me. If, if, we'll I, catch you, if, later, if, if I catch you uh, retweeting something, I'll mute you for the time being so I can miss it, then I'll, I'll mute you later. I'm not gonna lose. I mute myself for my protection. It's, I gotta protect my mute piece. myself. <laughs> you mute yourself. Have to. Oh, oh man. All right, I ain't I gonna I go hold you. Team Chris up on the chat again. You know, it looks like it's. Uh, Mortuso. 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 It's not a fun matchup for He's from Puerto Rico, though. He's having a good time out here. Oh, that's what you're representing for his flag. He's just fear coming through. Fireball, limb pressure, hard for her to get through. She wants to play that footsie game, and he disallows that. Trying to work his way in his team. Chris going for the first frame, but you're not reacting to DI. That's a punished counter. And my goodness. It's going to be a beat now. Uh, damage goes to the other side and catches him, but could not get the extension. But, oh, wow. my God. That teleport was on point. We were going to like, avoid it, Hizanshu. The one touch, right in back. It's not over, though. It's been, it's been early. I respect it. Team Chris dropping the conversion. And again, the Dini can't even see me. The side switch from the back door. Oh, hit it from the back. Chun Li is crazy, brother. I'm not going to lie to you. He said, send back. I'm crazy. Hizanshu trying to cut through the fireball. Drive in back with the lead. Calling out of the Yoga Flame. Gonna go kick right to the corner. Now we got pressure. Oh, the overhead blessing the head, but no conversion afterwards. And now he just out. But wait a second, another DI coming through. Wow. Is it gonna be a burnout? Yeah, maybe that's what he's looking for. Or at least close to it. No, not very close to it. Gonna have like a little bit of less. Maybe fireball right after. Yeah, trying to go for it, but that's the call though. The jump. Go for the corner. Oh, and now you're in burnout situation. It's not going to be a good time. Team Chris put a checkmate situation as soon as he saw the yoga man go gray. Very smart play. Far to bomb, though. Simply utilize that for an anti-air throw situation with damage. On the ground, Team Chris. Laying down the wall for legs. Oh, take out the rust. Yeah. Chris Chris going to throw. Oh, wait, no, a throw of his own. The low dive kick, fourth knockdown. Get to the other side. I got the high ground Anakin. Oh, no. <laughs> you can't press up to that. Mm. Number one. Hold on, no, Team Chris. Working. Oh. Try to shimmy. That fourth heavy kick. The teleport. You haven't seen the part of the bottom switch just yet. Yoga uppercut. Oh, and turn the back heavy nice. kick against the Hazanshu. Hazanshu oh, against Hazanshu's again. not going to be it there. You're going to keep trying, but I'm going to. Oh, wait a second. Hazanshu, I smell it. I smell it. <laughs> I just got a chew. Oh my god. Pikachu. All right. See, Chris, running it back. Honestly, level three, spin was not the worst idea. Hey, Kusha said yesterday, Team Chris got the, uh, they have the hairdo of the uh, protagonist right now, okay? The hairdo of the protagonist? Yeah, he has a protagonist hairdo right now. You can't you can't mess with this. He actually kind of has like the. It looks a little bit like Gohan, yeah. but with the with the red on. It's like sway back a little bit. Mm -hmm. This is this is not um. What, what's that new form of Gohan? Beast Gohan, or whatever. Beast Gohan. Oh yeah. That's when he gets. It. That's when Team Chris gets angry. Oh, then yeah. it starts to spike up. <gasps> Power levels is deep out here, man. The levels of this. The levels of this, bro. All right. Back into it, Team Chris. I'm game. Oh, is that Tesla? Is that back fierce? With, uh, to, uh, this is, uh, it's fierce. Preemptively, of all things, too, as well. Oh, he doesn't back. No punish on the DI, though. Oh, but we could punish this time. Yeah, it's hard to get in, isn't it? That was like three punish counters in a row. Jesus Christ, you're pushing stuff a ton. Follow ups, though, you know, in terms of damage, right? Yeah. Oh, uh, just, oh my god, I thought that was gonna be a uh, driver uh, to uh, Or like, yeah, you know, like a uh, yoga uppercut anti. That's why I was thinking all oh, triggered from the air to air. I'm over here. I'm over here. Oh man, it's running for his life. Oh, have to. They were doing this one. 
He's trying to do bad things to you. I like using the walk speed to skate underneath. Back throw. Wakes him with the Hazanju, gets a fireball, good call. Ooh, Finds the okay. overhead, but no follow up. There's a counter hit. A flutter's counter. Jumping, trying to teleport. And you see Chris trying to stay in that range where he's like, man, if he teleports, I need to be right there to be in front of him. Gets the Hazanju. Oh my god, the low fire but this kill there. Oh, he's still pressing the stand life punch. Of all things, stand light kick, drive us right after it. Legs in the super. Oh, he's trying to go for burnout, but it's not right there yet. But goes for the throw afterwards. Man, is Dawson level uh, one invincible? I don't know what the startup frames are. I'm level one. I think you can use level two for like uh, rebuttal, though. Usually you can use level two. And heavy kick, I like that as an entire choice. But I will say, though, Team Chris, like getting away with like throw pressure, but it's kind of hard. You don't want to like, because she doesn't have like a real throw. Yeah. But her swift thrust, that four medium punch, the stabbing that she's got, you're so afraid of getting blessed by that. He goes over here, but he's looking at a trade instead. The plus range with the kicks once again. You try to jump out, but wait a second, get the back throw. This will be your chance. You try to go for pressure instead. Bop, bop, smack down. Nice. With the ODDP, mm, right back. Oh, yeah, watch oh. out. A level one confirm is all that's needed. Chris hurts. knows. Chris knows. Hazanchu right Chris through. Knows. He knows. Knows the fireball timings. It's just that she don't got the defense. She's so don't, work. Yeah, she doesn't have defense. She's still a very strong, impressive character. Has mad damage, great setups, can Oki. Wonderful, honestly. It's just like when you knock her down, it's just like she, she only has one option being with bar. She doesn't have bar. <laughs> she gets cooked. She gets cooked. And also, I feel like you know, her buttons maybe not the best. Why would I interrupt you? Crouch? Yeah, here's the ball thing. Here's the ball thing. Run. run. You know what's the thing? It's like you gotta figure out what buttons are gonna get drive run. I guess for him, it's a crouch pierce. No, that's not what you wanted at all. You get punished. Slide by. Drive run. Overhead. Knocks it out though. Oh, we're doing in and out moves. Plus frames on plus frames, but nice tech on the throw. Hey, there's people watching, so you better feel you ready for prime time. You got everybody in the alley looking at this fight. Oh, oh, oh you drove rushing to the DP. Immediately. Double dashes up for the counter. No cardio cart though. Oh, catches the low four on the toes. He's gonna spend all the cash, and that should be the kill. Bop, 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 bop. That's the last one. Ooh, Battle wow. range. Up the stack. Oh, I didn't realize his name is Bangarang. He's like, he was from the Squirrelix for real. I just thought about that. Bangarang? Yeah. That was a good fun. I missed on W3. I always thought when someone said Ban, like, it was Bad Rang. Bop, 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 Bad Rang. Bad Rang. Goofy ass song. <laughs> Dash up throw, foot dive again. It's up in the corner, but he's the first one as possible. Just run up the gas. I like that same move punch. Plus, he's close enough. Oh, wait a second. Speeding the start. Oh my gosh. I'm surprised that was a DP right through. Oh, you're whipping, though. You got to be careful. That's a ah, on it. Yes. Check that knockdown. Yeah, there's some risk you got to get in, you know, with this character. It makes sense, but. Bad ring of the drive impact. You're going to catch a limb. He blocks it out. The should be staying solid. You see Jum. Vagabond, pick up. Tatsu. Goes out the can over here. The blocks. Plus frame on plus frame. Nothing afterwards, man. You can actually DP that one. Yeah, you could probably crouch fierce. It might be like the safest option. Ooh, over here. Ready. Ooh. Speed. For another extension. Another bar utilized. Like so in, but catch it with the oh the low forward is going to seal the deal. It's a fast paced match, I think a lot of it is. A lot of bar being spent right now. A lot of green on the screen. A lot of green on the screen indeed. Bangor Rain is doing very strong work right now. And Mr. B got to lock in, otherwise it looks like it might be curtain for him in the loser side. Rock rush, crouching medium kick, two problems with that stand medium punch. T-Rex limbs for this character. Ain't able to fight. In terms of like some uh, area and some secret. Oh my Stand god! Oh, brother. The in and out move oh. dropped the combo though, and now she's running up on you. This ain't looking too good for you, big fella. I know your theme is playing, but the night, it might not be your oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Looks like you have the facilities for that. Right. Bang a ring. One round away. Take it. Neutral jump, calling out the drive. Or not even drive, but was OD overhead. Hey, hey. Dash up, drive rush, whatever. He was ready. He was ready. Super puts him against the wall, double dashes up. Oh, the throw. Do it again. It's oh an overhead. Oh my god, I would have got hit too. He's gonna get a burst off this as well. Another Bang level ring. one. Not gonna Oh my god. The drive gauge is definitely what hurt him on the side. Bang a range thing, but it doesn't matter because they're gonna be able to get the kill. Oh wait, no, didn't get level one quite in time, but the throw is going to do it. Ended it out with a perfect initial beat. You had a great run, but bang a range. Show him why. Catch this FG Marathon coming through on the Luke. Also has a JP. Now.
I just saw him play I Overthink in the bracket to none of the losers. He picked JP for this matchup because he feels the better, you know, just overall yeah. for him, matchups in general. Look at that. Back up, pounding attack with the forward heavy kick. Now call up in the corner already. Yeah, and of course, JP's biggest change, right? Be that crouching heavy punch, no longer having that upper body invincibility. So making jump ins on him just a little bit easier. Still, granted, he has a lot of really strong jump in or anti air normals, I should say, and doing a good job spacing out with the ghosts right now. But there it is. Connor Spire, get right on in. Josh Fears. All this wind spires up for that plus rate situation. Mutual jump. Trying to keep the cage up in the corner as much as possible. Air Thrust still has ways to answer, as you pointed out. Air throw, air to air, as you pointed out. Board heavy kick, as we saw previously. And Amnesia will always back him up. Side switch off the oh teleport. My God. Yeah, put you right there into the corner. Observe this. Ooh, I like actually trying to close the distance there. Shame about the width, but we still have another opportunity to get on in. We're not dead yet. This is what I would say. <laughs> That's what I would say. That's what I would say. I'm still okay. Unfortunately, the departure is still locking down the neutral. Like you can hold parry and get your bar back a lot easier for the opponent, but it doesn't matter if you still get hit by it. So you want to advance and initiate OD. Wow, back to the side of Marathon. Oh, try it. Gets caught trying to jump out there. Nice throw attack. And then we just create space, right? I don't care if you're in the corner. I'll let you walk out. I want to play that zoning game here with JP. But walks right into the crouching heavy punch. Lucky that could have gone south real quick. Yeah, a little bit more. Crouching to kick me. Initiate. Crouch fierce. Not by the fault that he wanted. So that's bar at the bottom. Let's see what he uses it for. Maybe level three. Not just yet. If he gets OD Pierce into level three, that'll be the victory. I saw him do it earlier, but level three from the side of Chato. Stopping up the damage. Won't kill, but it will. Close to burnout here for Marathon. Yeah, and I love the idea there to finally use the OD Spire to go through the ghost, right? Of course, having that projectile invul invulnerability to so get in there. With the scaling. Heavy in terms of corner push. Level three. Oh, oh you're, you're, done. you're dead, right? For sure. We're in the yellow. CA. They want the scaling off the amnesia. And dead or dead, dead. And Chato didn't even notice was on the modern Lily. I've heard a lot of people go to that sort of form for this character. It's a little bit easier to react to things. Get through the fireballs faster. Maybe that's the intention here. And she still has all of her really strong buttons, right? Having that uh, that crouching heavy punch, honestly, one of the best buttons that she has. Two hits makes it really easy to get that hit confirm in. Yeah, and also you stock up behind it. I think that actually might be her best one, to be honest. I remember I was talking, talking about how like that's her like main tool, bread and butter. Stand fierce. Archer set up right there. They see OE too Ooh. far out for it. You see a punish counter coming through with a crouching light punch. The four frame teleport. And for Chato, that's kind of been the downside, right? We've been going for a lot of these spires to get on in, but we're just so short, just a little bit short. He's able to hit it this time, gets the wind stocks on. There's the command grab, and that killed! Wow! Even in modern. My dialed off the normal one, actually. So you can definitely do that, dial the normal. Command normal, I should say. Absolutely. Stan Pierce in the fireball, sets up the departure. That's it, it's a snap. The corner continues with the departure, so ruling the neutral, finds the side switch as well. All this time, gets hit with the portal, but isn't able to get the pickup off of it. So again, just backing up, recognizing that playing the zoning game is working out really well against Chato. I mean, his character can still zone. Like, he may be not dealing with the damage that he'd like to have in some sequences, but he can still definitely outzone a lot of his characters. See all these spikes coming through, locking down this full screen, and again, you see the departure, ruling the neutral. Marathon, looking to make this a very quick run. <laughs> Top eight. Yeah, absolutely. Let's see again with the whiff normals here. You gotta be careful about whipping those normals against JP, but we get the clean jump in. Gotta make this opportunity count, but we just allowed to escape. Was trying to grip Ghost. There's nobody there. Nothing but Casper, nothing but air. Departure, no pickup. Forget that Pierce has to be careful. One whiff. Well, Chato to get in. We got that part of the problem. We haven't seen it utilized just yet in this round, or even before. Saving for possibly level three to dump all the damage if need be. Oh, there's some medicine about her burnout walk, though. Yeah, man, because you know, <laughs> she's walking she can knock like down that. the bars back. And the with the crushing medium kick, side switch off the jump light kick. Oh, oh. look at the. Oh, man, the DI. Are you going to go for the level three? No. Interesting, the level three, I believe, would have put Marathon into burnout in that situation there. So I'm surprised we didn't spend it, but we still have this corner pressure. Gets the punish on the amnesia, and we close it out. A little bit about calling out. Those defensive tactics, like continuously, you know, you're afraid of the command grab, you're afraid of that level three. They're playing around that idea. All even out. We'll see who moves on this bracket. It's a typical one, I ain't gonna lie. All right, again, just holding forward here, too. The measured approach gets in with the plus frames, and that's what we want to see, right? We were going for a lot of those situations where we get the EX fire, but we weren't doing any kind of mix up following it. We were just giving FG Marathon the turn back. 
Fierce, Fireball. Backing up. Able to find that punish oh, counter on the Stan Fierce. I think significant, but we'll get that drive impact. Oh, D, we go for level one? No, not just yet. It would have killed, but we aim for the drive gauge. Still, looking fantastic. The Marathon trying to find the anti air. Baited out with the Condor dive. Yeah, but there we go. Ghosts are coming out once again. Gets that parry on deck. You got to be careful about your approach. Any stray hit will do it. Low on drive gauge as well. Oh. It's knocked down to the back. Yeah, back dash, back up. Jalen made with that DP situation. Oh, oh, finicky interaction allows the back throw to happen. FG Marathon taking back the momentum on set point. Yeah, that was tragic. We fully committed to that 2H. And now Marathon trying to run away with the momentum here. Like the fake out every so often you see off the ghost, like trying to make the bait out the bar usage, like tap parry. Those things add up. Absolutely, it does. And you can see it right there, even going for those drive rushes. We're down to half bar. But scoring that command grab is going to give us a little bit of extra. Oh, it's Frau. Was able to get the last part that confirmed for that knockdown. Still has him caught up in the corner. Crouch Pierce. Perfect carry OD in. The tech. Dangerous tech in the side of Marathon, but it works out. Alternating defense correctly, chat though. Yeah, the teleports right out of the corner, immediately backing up, playing the runaway game. OD level three, it's a rip of damage, brother. Oh, Ant's gonna put Chato in burnout as well. This is a really dangerous place to be, stuck between a rock and a hard place, Cola. Oh, you're just dead, he did that previously, I forgot that damage. Never mind. He's insane, <laughs> OD Pierce. Yeah, that say like Ryu or someone else has. One of the problems I've also seen, actually Punk talk about is like the projectiles have been problematic for him to get around, and that could be just, this character's new. First week of this character being dropped, so we don't have a developed game plan to get with the fireballs. So it might be, you know, placebo for right now if we develop something. We'll have to see. You see, he's got that Philly shell style on lock, playing mm -hmm. that that Mashi, uh, Mashi, uh, Mishu, uh, excuse me, bro, Mashiba. Mashiba. <laughs> Mashiba, the Epo character here. Bro. The Outbox or the Grim Reaper. I almost want to play this character because I like Epo so much, bro. Even it's if okay. it, the manga is a little, little slow right now, <laughs> we don't talk about that. I ain't trying to spoil nothing, but so take called, my man off the pitch. I'm caught please. up. You ain't spoiling anything for me. Oh, well, I mean, the chat, though. Oh, oh perfect, perfect KO. The side of Punk group, this character can definitely work in these high stress. Yeah, and th that standing heavy kick that he has, uh, being like you know a really solid plus on block normal, it's just difficult to find a lot of situations because it's gonna whiff on crouching opponents. Mm -hmm. But here we go, you know, trying to use those charged flickers, there, the psycho flickers, to get something started. It would be a good idea because if we get a punish card, get that crumple still skin knocked down. Mm -hmm. get, uh, you know, getting get nasty with that. <laughs> I mean, one thing you gotta keep in mind too, you were talking about Ed, yeah, he's definitely an outboxer. He wants to play that patient game, he wants to force mm -hmm. you to whiff. He doesn't have overheads, so it's not yeah. an intuitive character to really rush down with. And also, he's hard, it's hard to stop drive rush with him. Mm -hmm. It's actually difficult to find like the right button. Punish, not the biggest one though. Could have been at least into like light and so bot. What's that knockdown, the soap oh, trade. trade. Yeah, it's there we saucy. go. Saucy. Air slasher from the side. A squall. Whoa! Happy. Is it with the fireball we drive rush up? Yeah, just a little too far away to get that standing heavy punch though at the end. We could have connected that. We could have got the kill easily with the level two, but instead we're gonna go straight into the level three here. String him up. He's doing strings. Punk with the first victory. Squall getting a little bit lost right now, as most people would be when they find a new character. But it felt like you know he makes you uncomfortable. Like as you pointed out, being an out outboxer, like outside the distance, zoning with the flicker every so often, and that snatcher too as well. If that hits you, that's punish counter and the dash up damage, and the damage that we dumped out at the end right there with that level three. Punk gets the first victory. We'll see what happens, though. Oh, just jumps over to the other side, but does get hit by that flash kick. Nice. Able to score the throw here. Closing the distance a little bit, but you see that Punk is kind of staying at just Damn. at that standing medium punch range. Or standing medium kick range, I should say. Excuse me. Was he able to get that heavy kick follow-up because he was crouching? That's one of the problems with that uh, heavy kick. That Ed has the throw, kill rush with the DP immediately. But deal with none of that nonsense like the parries that we're seeing here. The spacing that Punk is keeping is so perfect. Gets the charge, back dash straight into the standing heavy punch. This is gonna be a lot of damage into the level one. In the corner, with the situation, Shaco for the meaty fireball. DP against Squall now in burnout. Has to get aggressive, get that bar back faster. Doesn't wanna let Punk put on the impression, dash up again, the three piece, into the Sobot. No charge, get those plus frames, backing up again. Yeah, we're just being very cautious about the approach. Goes for the EX. EX is nice also for those free plus frames just to pull your opponent That's in. That's true. Drive impact right back and Squall with the reaction and staying a little bit more solid. 
I like that. Give a little more defensive. I thought it was going to be long for him because he was in burnout. And we've seen this character harass the snatches, but he stays solid. Staving off set point. It was smart to be defensive in that situation because we've already talked about how uh, Ed doesn't really have the greatest rushdown tools, right? Yeah, so really if you're doesn't. just sitting back and patient, forcing him to come to you, you can force him into those uncomfortable situations and score those punishes. A lot of things that come from Ed actually are a lot more risky than I thought they would be. You know, so many sequences. You know, Indian's turn, you know, not a lot of plus frames. And the ones that are plus, like the heavy kick, they have to be standing for that to be landing. And they crouch that, see it be ducked, a nice sweep off the feet though from the side of Punk. Yeah, there we go, dashing on in. Gets him with the tick throw. We're off that standing light punch. The heavy kick, all oh, the sway play. If you would have committed, I think that would have hit the Stamp Ears. See, oh, oh yeah, nice shimmy. Be able to close it out there, yes, with the EXDP. Puck sitting on set point. A lot of bar at the bottom. Might just dump that off for level three. We haven't seen like level two be developed just yet. So I think the game plan right now is if we don't know how to utilize that for the mix-up opportunity, go for the level three, go for the damage. Let's oh. see if he utilize, utilizes it real soon here. Yeah, that was a big opportunity oh. there where we could have gone off of the standing heavy punch. If you went just immediately for the, the core circle back EX, you could have gotten mm. that huge level two confirmed. Wait, right. The fireball. Like, I think he's just looking for that level three like that. Even though I want to see more of that level two at this point, it's definitely one hit in the level three for that victory, or he'll try oh, to use level one no. to skate through. That did not work out, so now all you have is level two. Yeah, I think level two is really honestly where a lot of the depth is going to come in for this character, That's whether it true. be for setups. Right now, everyone's kind of using it for combos, but the set play potential on it is incredible. Speaking of incredible, there's a great confirm in to the level three. So the yellow stand was not mellow. Brother, almost dead. OD Fireball, you drive a shot, he does with the jab. That sway play comes in clutch. He has been setting up continuously. You've seen jab, sway, you've seen just drive rush sway. And he actually commits this time for that funky slice for follow up. DJ Sway making him look like the real boxer on the screen right now. Bro, I'm telling you, someone said, oh, Ed got sway. I'm like, that's appropriation. <laughs> just because it's March 1st only or March 2nd, only you can do that. Just saying, it don't feel right. There's Sasha coming through it again. Hard to do like a fireball to fireball war with DJ in the first place, and even more so with Ed, the way his fireballs work. Oh, there it is. I was about to mention, so you've been seeing Punk go for a lot of the standing medium kick, which is really good, but I think that crouching medium kick is an incredible poking tool, yes. especially because it is drive rush cancelable. That's true. Or if you don't want to link into it, you just use the uh, heavy flicker, I believe. That also could be like a safe and solid option. he will drive rush up. Heavy kick, heavy kick. It's waiting for the dumpy on a damage. It's been heavy kick, heavy kick, drive rush, heavy kick, heavy kick. Yeah. For a lot of conversions and combos. So he has some simplicity in terms of maximizing his damage, but there's other routes that might be a little more depending on what happens with level two. Yeah, and I think, of course, going for those meter, uh, the meter positive routes are going to be really important in the future, trying to build up to that level two super. But so far, level two has not come out yet in this set here. Punk's been holding on to it. First Small. reversal from him. Again, being really patient, oh, too far away. That's surprising. Don't usually see it. Whip, Swall, Swall, Squall with the pickup. Yeah, there we go. The medium so bought to make him drop. Final game, final round. Punk riding and dying with this character possibly, or will he move on with Ed? We'll have to see. Gets the cross up there. A little grip of damage coming through, but he's still sitting on three bars. Stocked up. There nice whip go. punish. This is for that stand medium kick. I don't know what he's looking for. It's a punish, but no pick up the jab again, Jobber. Oh my god. This is so unfortunate. Yeah, that jab is definitely leaves a lot to be desired here, but Punk is doing a really good job playing that. What I believe is Ed's optimal game plan is that with punish play. Outboxer, bro. We talked about that. Oh, he would have got that snatcher against that stand medium kick. We got that crumple. All right, but stuck here in the corner. This is a dangerous place to be, especially with Squall sitting at level three. Tosses him out. Going to give him a little bit of breathing room, but immediately getting right on in. Nice walk under punish counter throw. Drive rush up. Goes for the low, the reset. I love that off the shimmy. The finesse and bless. Put this man to rest. The CA immediately stringing him up and put him down to losers. It's Punk moving on in the clutch. Bro, he actually asked me, he was like, can you sing with me? I was like, I got you. I looked at him like, <laughs> no, it's you're on your you. own, brother. There's only one mic up there. <laughs> All right, let's see who moves on in between these two. There's only one that can get it done at the very end of the day in terms of TNS 9 to play. Moving on, these two having to fight each other. It's a classic that we see in TNS. It's hell throughout Street Fighter's lifespan. And we ain't even at top eight yet, so sad to see one of these players get sent down to the loser side of the bracket. That's but there true. it is, crouching medium kick, getting the full drive rush confirmed. Going for a little bit of a shimmy, but Idama's not going to bite. 
Is that fireball ruling the neutral continuously? She has options over, but I don't think they're really consistent. Like, you can spin, possibly, but Jack could be looking for that. We'll find a punishing kind. Yeah, and the minor buff that she got just kind of makes the height on her super just a little more consistent, right? It's nothing mm -hmm. too crazy. Get the pickup, stocks up, fireball. Not close enough for that stand, medium punch. The sweep off the feet, gets a side switch and a grip right after it. Oh, and Jack's wake up. Oh, the fake out. Maybe looking for like reversal wake or super. Ooh. Doesn't matter. Three piece come from the side of Jack. No fries. Yeah, that one's a little tragic to see. Trying to go for that anti air there. But still, you saw a little bit of a nod there from Idom. Idom's one of those players who doesn't really ever get tilted. He's always so calm, right? Calm and collected. He yeah, you're not going to see back. it on his face. You know, you're definitely going to see it. You might hear it on stream, though. <laughs> <laughs> super right after the pickup. Oh, so close to burnout here, too. Looking for that meaty for that exact reason, but that's why Jack read it with the level one. Saves his drive, gets up going for that ODDP, but we wake up with buttons too as well. Idom striking back. Just needs to find that last touch. Impact, Ooh. hold the parry. Burnout is Jack. He's got to go for that level two. Take the momentum back. He finds a side switch, but wasn't able to get the confirm. That would have been sick. Yeah, we're just a little too far away after that jump, and there we go. Those dancers' legs reaching right on in. Three medals. Consistent. Drive brush throw Whoa. immediately from Jack. No respect. I mean, they play each other so much that we've seen some wild ass stuff happen between these two. So it makes sense. Jack, like the overhead reset. Didn't work out. Idom stand blocking. Not dropping. Oh, you see them trying to. She's trying to reach out there, get that whiff punish going in. But the air splits, bro? Ooh. Spread Eagle. Backs away. The stand fierce fireballs to play the walk up throw against the preemptive parry. This is going to hurt. Yeah, oh, you'll fall. That fireball is not involved. Oh, hold on, he looks kind of tilted. I'm not oh, hold on. <laughs> Exclamation mark, what? <laughs> Game's great. Idom down a game. Jack up one. Again, to move on the topic, definitely will not want to be on the loser side. Uh, Demon's down there. Perfect parry. Going to get the pickup. More importantly, Feng Shui more and more for that resource. Yeah, but already in burnout here. Idom needs to get more aggressive. And there's the stun. Lucky for Idom, not a lot of meter available on Jack's side, right? So going to be able to survive that with very little damage done. Get that drive gauge back immediately. Dash Still. up, take throw. Dash up again this time, a medium punch. That's plus. You're caught up on the corner. It's a good harassment tool. And this is the end, Jack. On set point. Bro, let me out. <laughs> Bro, it's Akon style right there. Locked up. Careful now. I don't. We'll see if we can turn up like volume. I don't know, bro. I don't know. Yeah, toss back into the corner here and just gets hit by the honest Midge. Tried to wake up pressing something. I don't know what we were going for there. Super? But either way, the Feng Shui engine now is on lock. Bro, the and fact it is that she revving. do that, the foot dive and have a, like, a follow-up right after that, insane. Nasty Still work. has bar. Dive kick. What's next? Empty throw. He texts though. And oh. a perfect to close things out. What an exclamation mark at the end. To be fair, Paul always has a smirk on his face. I've, <laughs> I've seen that man smirk against JP, and I was like, are you good? <laughs> Maybe that's a different kind of smirk where you're just kind of like, you got malice in your heart. We'll see, though. We'll see. Has he cracked the code here against Knuckle Dew? We're about to find out. Knuckle Dew hot off his top 16 CPT qualification. ODDP against the fire boss that we're waking up, Paladin. That we feel saucy right now. Yeah, slowly trying to inch your way forward. Knuckle Dew, the type of guy, though, who's not just going to sit back and throw out Sonic Boons, even if he has the life lead, right? Yes, he he wants to get and he wants to brawl. He loves to interact. I like that. I like a guy player that does that because he has great buttons, right? Like, all these buttons, maybe they end their, his turn sometimes, but we have the driver's behind it. And you get things like this, crouching, immune kick, punish counter. Oh, my God. Brother, right to the fireball. Like it was bro. already buffed, bro. What? I thought that was buffed away where you can't just flash kick right through, oh, but the bro, punish. Oh, bro, we went for the Tatsu swinging like Drake. This <laughs> is swinging like Drake. Uh, here we go. Huh? The next round. <laughs> 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 Yo, <jumper. laughs> I saw the picture. <laughs> oh. All right. Trying again. Go for these parries. I like the EXDP. OD immediately gets the fireball. Yeah, he gets the digit charge. You may be able to toe-to-toe with these fireballs, but you have to send it out. You can't just go for the zoning or hold it, so it makes it problematic for this character. Drive rush. Gets a counter conversion. Starts off with the baby boomers. Marching towards the end. Yeah. Send them out. These are yours. Heavy kick. Ooh. The follow-up flash kick. Was it late for the cross-up? Disgusting work here. And again, just it, the pressure is on. Paladin is low on drive gauge. Constantly forced to block. Sends out the OD fireball, but still not enough. Ooh, he almost fell on that fireball. I mean, Nukudu has such a big lead right now. 
preparing for the side of Paladin. Can he do something different than what we've seen at TNS? There's the perfect parry. Oh, Trey's actually there with the standing light kick. Oh, another Drake Bang. Finishing the job and biting through Paladin's chances, possibly moving on the bracket. Takes a second to regain himself. I like it. Going back to character select. Always go back to character select. If you're in a high stakes tournament environment here, right, and you're feeling a little bit of the heat, well, we're actually going back because we're going to make the switch here to Luke. No. No Paladin. Does evil, no Paladin. Evil Paladin be like Sandblast. What do you think is on Dude's phone, by the way? He was looking at this. What do you think he's looking at this, his chat, his stream? I don't think that's. Is it, is it just the chair? It's the, of course it's a chair, bro. The chair don't leave. The chair never leaves. Okay, Paladin, let's see if we really got a Luke, bro. I, I feel like he, he's maybe trying to develop an answer. It's like another character. But I feel like this one of those matchups that's pretty damn even in the first place. Maybe not even better for Gal. I don't want to say like Gal beats Luke, but that change to Crouchy's no, medium yeah. punch definitely had to help out. Yeah, for sure. I mean, Crouching Medium Punch is going to be a great tool, you know, that Luke has. But Luke's got kind of similar tools or similar game plan in a way to Ryu, right? So he can still play that same game. Of course, you have things like this. this level one being really solid, but not when you get blocked. But we're spending it all. Oh, yeah, he bought the ball. Level one, the Sonic Hurricane gets it done. Knuckle do. So you should have stuck to Ryu. <laughs> it's not your character, bro. It's not your character. Paladin. All right, the point blank booms that you see coming out goes for the bazooka knee right there into the snapdragon suplex. DP is gonna whiff, this is gonna hurt. Flash kick right after it, DD played. Perfect parry, the punish. Positional bench, he drops the conversion. Definitely with the punch, the back heavy punch in the super. Meaty boom again, locking this man down up in the corner. It's jail, no bail. Oh, again, getting that jump and trying to reset with the throw. Nice shimmy, knuckle do, putting down this Dusty ass loop. <laughs> Don't ever do that again, Paladin. He skipped the he skipped intro. The, yeah. Really? He usually. Oh, maybe that was I don't do. think Scrawl skipped it. Or maybe, or maybe, uh, maybe Duke Kevin did that. Yeah. Duke Kevin was like, enough. I'm tired of you singing. Here we go. You want to talk about anime characters? Rashid here. Yes, sir. It's very, very anime. You see that right there? The OEDP? As an entire actually works out. Yeah. No more Gotcha Pete Sad Face. Not JP. Here we go, Scrawl trying to keep things. So Duel Kevin already burning himself out, not even down to 80 seconds on the clock here. Started off really strong. That's the interesting thing about the drive system, right? Just giving mm -hmm. you the freedom to do that. Yeah, be careful now. Play very defensive. Whip punish, Sam Fierce. Knock down an eagle spike. Be crushing, to punch for the plus frames. I like that Duel Kevin's like not playing the mirror. We uh, may be wrongly assumed going with this character. Things have gotten better for the side of Rashid versus Luke. Drive rush, crouching light kick, stand medium kick. Oh, yeah. Ooh, the shimmy again with the stand fierce. Yeah, hey, Rashid's shimmy game is so strong, having that movement speed and those long reaching normals, right? Being able to just capitalize in a big way. Yeah, stand fierce, especially crouching medium kick. Best buttons for it. Oh, maybe should have committed to that uh, target combo, but easier said than done. There we go, sticking out the foot. Gonna get caught trying to go for the sandblast this time with that drive rush forward. Now toss back into the corner. Level two, here it comes. Ooh, Kevin. Dumping out the winds in the Windy City himself. Makes a whole parry. Shimmy again, Stan Fierce. That's Mixer. He ends up using more drive gauge off that jab. Medium Mixer. A follow up mix up. He even says mix up. Let's go stay solid. I lied. Heavy kick applied. And still nowhere to run, but we are mashing. Just getting out of there, but not able to get the knuckle there at the end. Really unfortunate. And there's the punish counter. Committed to the heavy knuckle isn't gonna work out. I can tell you, he's thinking. You ain't pulling the beard hair from your chin like that if you ain't thinking, bro. Also, he got the Akatsuki fist, so he must have won some previous. He did. He did okay. win earlier. What did he win? I, I'm not. I don't remember. I was busy doing commentary. Yeah, yeah. But I did know that he did win a early tournament earlier. All right, can he win another one? Can he get two? Bro, two Akatsuki rows? We'll be on a fire. <laughs> No one's ever done it in the history of TNS9. <laughs> You're right. First time we've done it at TNS, but still, it doesn't matter. First time. Oh, and there we go. Getting caught with the shimmies over and over here. Yeah, stand to punch. Clinical right now. The overhead. Punish counter only. Tries to go for that. Maybe back throw. Scrawl up in the corner. Yeah, trying to get the poke out there. This time actually commits to the target combo, just like you mentioned earlier. But sent right back into the corner again with the punish. Counter duel. Kevin at set point. Read the tendencies correctly, continuously against Scrawl. Step stand fierce. Over and over again. Here's a crouching medium punch still. A good button when it lands. Chaser for the Oki. 
Okay, there's some fireball. Lose the turn, so do Kevin. We'll find the side switch. Immediately sets up the level two tornado here. Trumpet Wing coming through. No, oh, careful. That's smart. All right, stopping early, but you're still caught in the mix. Going for the, the drive reversal to get out of there. I said, back it up a bit. <laughs> drive rush, medium. Careful now again. We're looking for that stamp your shimmy. Attack on the throw. You see Scrot finally starting to really adapt here now. Making much smarter plays. There's the trade. Not going to be able to get anything off of that. But the standing medium kick. Oh. Trying to space it out, and the jump in is huge. Yeah, he called out that button. Frank kill with the throw. Go for the overhead. Go for the dash up throw again. Counter hit. Well time. Finds the overhead, and now you're finally dead. Had Bar at the bottom of the spin. That's the win. Dual Kevin moving on. He's played that matchup so much. The true conversion Ooh. combo. But Demon coming through like a true demon here with the jury. <laughs> Million dollar character. Oh, I, love you. I like smile. the way that Demon just don't move his character. And Simple Tricks no. with a smile every dang time. He's here to work, brother. Yeah. He's right here to cash out. He's in losers. This is where it really gets scary. Oh, there we nice. go. The stand oh. beers. You know, I, I talked to Jack right before this. Uh, he said the matchup's even. He said he thinks it's even. You, and really? possibly slightly in, in uh, his favor. You know, the buttons are really better on his side. He can hop over the fireballs. I don't know, man. That sounds like coping to me, to be honest. Uh, <laughs> who knows these days? It depends on the region, the players, and things like that, too. I get different answers when I talk to Japan, this land. It won't. The level one interrupts the stand light kick. All right, dashing on in. Look at that dash distance and speed. And now creating a little bit of space here. Got to buy time to allow that drive gauge to come back. Drop him down. In burnout. out. Drive impact. That's around. Simple tricks. Simple stuff. OD. Ooh, the German. Yeah, I think the button-to-button -button ratio is not too bad, you know? Yeah, not when it comes terrible. to this, like, when the back and forth, obviously there's more in terms of what she can get off. But Dave, you're too close. Wow. I can smell your breath. I'll check over the Siberian Express. Reset did not work out. I like that, though. You have to test them early, right, to see if they can react to it. Because now Simple Tricks is going to no, I can't go for that anymore, yeah. right? Or maybe we'll do stand like it and see if they jump or yeah. something different and, like, react to that. We'll see. Fake out. Take the command grip too far out for that grip. You have a nice throw tech there. Getting stomped right on the dome to the other side. Create some distance there after a couple hits. Sound like it's on the medium. Gets the three piece off. He's got that drive rush counter hit. Oh no. Counter hit. Level one. Yeah, send him full screen. And now we're just going to get some stocks up here to create some space. We trade stocks up right now after Capcom Club. I ain't going to lie. <laughs> Press himself out, though. Oh, we are jumping back. Oh, you got too close. Not quite dead yet, though. And Silver Tricks is still in burnout, so he can't go for the drivers forward. And the low, just dropping low right there. She like kick the seal the deal. Catching the walk back and forward. Demon's got to be careful and, you know, capitalize on the burnout moments more often than not. Absolutely. You saw Demon immediately mashed on rematch, too. Yeah. No taking time to ponder about what went wrong here. Oh, not to their detriment. Don't get close. <laughs> <laughs> Just simply don't get close to Geek. There we go. Try to go for that reset again. The stand light kick. Severian Express did not work out. Demon going north to not go south. But again, the command grab. When he's not looking, when he's not being conscious of how close he is to Geek. Mm -hmm. It's easier said than done, right? You want to approach this character, harass continuously. Yeah, especially Jury. Jury wants to completely rush you down, right? But that's exactly where Geef wants you to be, so it can be dangerous sometimes, especially with the great defense that Simple Tricks has. Reset, foot dive, side switch. Off of the throw. No! Whoa. SVD! He's got bar. Drive rush. Jump in, headbutt. We're trying to put the pressure on here. Dan oh, like what a the hit. Punish. Command grab! Simple Tricks! So this is simple things, bro. Set point now here. Just needs one more to close it out. Demon does have two bars on deck, but the same thing can be said for Geef. It's loser side. You don't want to go home sad. Drive rush, jab, stab. See the Lari right after. Get that oh, drive impact. No. no, it's a punish. Yeah, huge punish there, too. Recognize that there was no way that it was going to reach. Sent out that standing heavy kick. And look at the range on that SPD. He has been like 9 for 10 right now on where to land that SPD continuously. Gosh, there's anti-air, a lot of stocks, but there's the hop right over. Even that drop kick is really good against the fireball. You're too close against to be a punish, and guess what I want? Oh Only my for God. my loyal fans, <laughs> $5.99, buy it now. Buy it now. Simple Tricks moving on, and the bracket demon is out. Wow, that was just, uh, it felt like a painting. Poetry in motion there with Geef. 17 years old, able to play this game Ooh. at this level. Insane, right? And it's picked a good character, I feel like. If, if I was, like, I'd be picking the top of the tiers out here. And even though there has been nerfs to the character, right, we've seen it work out at this tournament. Absolutely fine. The crouch fierce 
anti-air, doesn't matter too much because he's got 20 other ways to play at that sky space. Yeah, he has incredible anti-airs all around. And even still, we've seen the Crouching Heavy Punch hit, right? Yeah. It's worked as an anti-air anyway, so it doesn't feel like it's been nerfed too hard quite yet. Okay, the four fears gets a knockdown with Spire. It's caught up in the corner, stocks up, careful now. A jump mini punch could have bust that dome. Down forward, heavy punch for the knockdown. The side of a Apology Boy. Stan Pierce, only fireball. Pierce right after, swinging a lot of bar, actually. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's spending a lot of bar because we're so close to getting this kill, right? Wants to finish the food, but you gotta be careful now. Very close to being burnt out, and there it is, and now you're stuck in the corner. Goes for the OD Amnesia. Or the side regular switch. Amnesia, excuse me. Oh, still gets to hit the overhead. I do believe that was. Apology Boy taking the first victory. Right, straightened around number two, though. Wow, raw switch startups with recovery, too, as well. <sighs> so confident in his play at the moment. Sets up the double portal. Perfect parry on the Pierce, now trying to close the distance with the Spire. Shimmy. Stan Pierce still a bless butt. So let it whip. Throw on hit. Equalize a lot of damage. Look at that. Level three immediately. Big lead. Bar back in the green. Maybe set up for OD departure after this or dash of Frank Hill. Let's see. I feel like I've seen this story before. <laughs> We watched this exact match earlier on here in this pool. Oh, yeah? Yeah. And JP came out on top in the end here, so. Oh, yeah, it's true. It's marathon. I have a short memory. <laughs> Side switch, jump, light kick. Backs up. Yeah, I like these back jumps avoiding spaces where Connor Spire is not going to hit. Drop for first, he's got the bar to do so. Oh, but the Pierce comes out again and just not able to close the distance here is one of the difficult, most difficult parts about dealing with JP. No apologies right here for picking this character. He said, let me calm it down a little bit. I'm kind of cooking. I'm in the kitchen. The apron's on. Texting his coach. <laughs> like, I how do I think, pick this character? Oh, I would think right now, look at the uh, the nerf list. Like, I thought they nerfed this character. What, what the hell? <laughs> let me look back at the nerf list real quick. Ah, I thought they. He said, wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. It says right here. Stand Fierce, the punishable. Crouch Fierce. Crouch Fierce. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They said they nerfed the character. What? The, yeah, the JP players. I'm looking on Twitter right now. Damn. The character's what? bad. That's crazy. That's a that's an TE2 there. Classic TE2. Old school. I ever think definitely the old, say, the, old the school. The stock art, too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Jumping right on in again. Goes for the neutral jump there. Wow, risky with this play. The down for heavy punch continuously. Hella punishable. Like double digits, but we've seen it come out continuously. Right, here we go. Command grab lands. Taking out a big chunk, allowing us to get a stock of wind up. So we can get that EX. Whip punch with the stamp here still. The knockdown drive reversal to back it up a bit. Back in again. Backs away looking for a shimmy or maybe an amnesia. There, there it, it is. is. Speak of the devil and he will appear. Drive in pack. It was clear it's going to come through. Mans is looking ashy and burnout. The frame kill. What's the setup after this though? Stan Pierce, Pierce, departure. OD gets a throw right after. Get the second hit. Stan Pierce again to departure. Nasty oh, yeah. She got no defense, bro. No DP. Yeah, sets up the level two. You are not going to be able to get out of that for free. Could have been worse here. Able to score the throw. Now is in charge of the situation. What? Wow. I don't know what that was. Was it an error or a bait against anything? I don't know what it was, but I do know it's a waste of bar. You know, it's a set point situation here for Apology Boy. That was like a 4D level <laughs> <laughs> yeah. level bait out. We that were trying to bait sick. out an anti-air, I believe what Maybe. it was. That's a very wild bait. I ain't going to lie. That's like a frustrated bait. I ain't going I can't lie, bro. That's a frustrated, like, I hope this works. All right, able to get the punish counter. Nothing off of it, though. Sam Light Punch again. Departures out. And we've, we've just been kind of frozen the moment that that portal comes out, right? When I mean, departure comes out, we, we it's so difficult to move forward when that is on screen. It is, but you can go parry your bar back, so it's not so bad as it used to be. Nice DP. Has the ball for the OD right there. I think, I overthink. It's fine to hold parry as long as there's no initiation on the other side of the JP player. Which there is right now. Drive rush crouching, medium kick. It's an apology, boy. Speedy on in. This man don't even have his driver's license. I'm not even old enough for that. <laughs> but he can take that drive gauge. Oh, here we go. Trying to jump in. Gets the back throw. This is nice. Look at apology, boy's drive gauge here. Very low. Stamp fears. No level three. Drive reversal. Waits and baits. Eats the minus eight. A lot of damage. Just go up in the corner. Runs a level two raw. I kind of like that sending out that level two, right? Giving you a little bit more breathing room to escape from the corner, especially when uh, you know Lily's coming in with that critical art on lock. And speak of it, should be enough to get the kill. It's a lot. You about that drop? The CA extra cutscene, extra damage. It's enough. 
I overthink. Still in the game. Still in. But honestly, he had to confirm. I felt like off the ghost. I felt like he could have went yeah. to level three instead of having to wake up to level two and didn't get too much off that level two situation to get that kill. So if you're Apology Boy, you know what to fix. It's a few more things with that meter management. Let's see now jumping in here again, getting aggressive. Oh, both with throws. We were willing to play that zoning game a little bit before, but it seems now like Apology Boy wants to go in. It's that young man mentality, you know? I feel you happy with uh, JP these days. Like, I, I like that game plan for JP players. You can't just sit back and zone as much, even more so now that the nerfs have happened to him. Perfect parry. Gets a command grab. Yep, when stocks up, this is where Lily gets scary. But a perfect parry. Oh, multiple hits. I believe you have to That's hold right. it. I think you have to just hold That's that right. right after, yeah. Set full screen. And now observe. And you see, exactly. I overthink. The moment that the uh, the departure comes out, we just don't go forward. Yeah, we don't. We need to advance forward. Heavy kick. Heavy kick for the plus frames. Puts them in burnout, but did not come into the level two. I'm surprised. You had them in burnout at that point. Go for the conversion side switch. Oh, bro. Don't let it be. Yeah, activate oh. immediately. Man's looking ashy. Should have got the Jurgens. Oh, he didn't kill with an oh. OD will. Yeah, it wouldn't have mattered anyway, right? You were in dangerous chip range. You would have had to go hard in to get that kill and bring that back. You're basically forced to block against JP when you're sitting at that distance. Okay, for now, able to get their drive impact right back. Apology Boy with the reactions. Never say sorry. All right, here we go. Teleport to the other side. Get the side swap. Back away. And the jump back has been playing off really well, right? Just to avoid a lot of those spires. Is it ripped? Down for a heavy punch again. Wakes up. It's a heavy kick of all things. I mean, you got, you're getting close to level two once again. Apology Boy can get to that point. Could be devious. You can burn him out. Oh, How to come to Had to do that. He's not Still dead. alive, bro. The damage there. But finally, a poke is going to be able to close that out. And now here we are, one apiece, final game, final round. Who is getting eliminated from the bracket, Cola? Oh no, finds the overhead, no follow up though, stubby buttons. OD drive reversal immediately. Back in to get his eye over thing. <laughs> yeah, why not just do it again there? If you got the stocks, get those plus frames. That's true, on the advantage. And we get that back though, avoids the departure. Burn up. This is bad here for this character. Can't run that OD, have to do the normal amnesia. He backs up looking for it. Was able to find the stamp here's fall. Perfect, Perfect. parry. Nice chunk of damage, even with the perfect parry scaling. There's the anti-air, and we send it again in these JP matches as well. I do hope that, you know, moving forward, we get more smaller ones like this. Maybe during, like, the interim of breaks between, like, CPT events or something like that. Yeah. I'd love to see that. I'd also love to see more offline. But anyway, we're going to be seeing a mirror match, a very wily one. It's definitely a game of who could pierce the most. Who's pierce is there anyway? That's why I prefer for the JP player. Like, anyway, that's oh, crazy, the command though. grab. Wow, it's usually Kid Frost that loves to do that. Perfect parry, back throw, Chicago punish, working out very well. The positional advantage and the OD departure. And just a double dash forward there too, trying to fake out that throw attempt. You have to see that parry, throw it. Immediately command goes for the grab. point blank command grab. That's gonna be good because they vote for Amnesia. I do think that works. Actually, I'm not sure. I have to revert that because I'm not 100% sure what happens. So they go for OD Amnesia? It seems like it makes sense because it's got a bit of a delay on it, right? So yeah, the so Amnesia maybe. should win. Oh, maybe. Put that in the lab. We'll see. Maybe what happens in this matchup. The anti is right there for Crouch Fears. And Kid Frost being a little jump happy here now. Mostly just trying not to block and get burnt out, right? That's why we're constantly holding up, trying to jump. Getting a lot of the drive gauge back on that parry, but it's not going to matter if you get clipped on the dome. Wow, go close. As so people are pointing out, did you play Jury move over to JP? Doing work against Kid Frost, we've known him for to be a JP player. ETL's own. Stan Fears, so slash down for a heavy punch, looking to catch him unawares. Not the biggest punish though. Maybe back medium punch would have worked out, I'm not sure. Oh, with the perfect parry there. Able to go on in, get a little bit of damage. Oh, now they're really playing footsies under the table. <laughs> Gripper the Gripper. Stan heavy kick hits. Piers, double dashes up. We back away immediately. Still finds the anti just fine with the crouch fears. Departures out. Burnout also. Yeah, now we're keeping this pressure up. Get as many plus frames as we possibly can. Build up that chip damage while you're at it. It's a right kick. The drive impact, no level two at all. Drive impact, actually didn't have level two just yet. Built up, no sequence for that as well. Oh, interesting. Just going for the setup there. Didn't really cash in on a lot of damage. Huh. 
That's really? Wonder. I gotta wonder if that's gonna come back to haunt Kid Frost here, right? You got the stun, you might as well take a lot of damage in the process. Level two is out. OD, the follow up. Yes, oh, the second hit, the stand, Fierce finds a finish. Go low, bro. And he, do you see that look he gave him? He said, man, this character cheap. <laughs> yeah, now I get it now, I get it now. Yeah, JP pretty good. <laughs> oh no, so. I wonder what the switch up will be. I've seen Kid Frost hover on other characters. I don't know if he'll pick another character, even if it's a mirror match. Mirror matches are so weird. You're playing the player. They are. There's yeah. some character to character stuff, like, you know, but a lot of it comes down to playing the player and their play style. Their optimal range is your optimal range. It's weird. Yeah, I mean, in a lot of. It's interesting because in a lot of mirror matches in some games, uh, characters have a hard time dealing with their own tools, right? Yeah. But really, what it all comes down to is it comes down to the, the player matchup. You got the same tools, you have the same options. So it's all about who can execute it better. And right now, Goat Gloat is the one who is in the lead. Kid Frost has to make these adjustments here. He's trying to close the distance, goes to the teleport. OD is out. Command grab again. I see that. All right, but there's the grab. Throw tech. Get a little bit of a punish there. There it is. Dash up, get the 2H. And now we have you full screen. All right, thrown into the corner. Oh, he tried to go for the low, but the meaty wasn't quite meaty enough. It sends him back. Straight into the level two. And look at the damage that's coming out here. Don't worry, y'all. Cola broke his mic. We're fixing it. <laughs> <laughs> can y'all even hear him? <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, now they can. Now okay, there you go. Go, 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 Hey, hey, listen. This is like the second time I've had an issue with this mic. I got to sit on the other side. Anyway, hey, bro, treat back these to the things play. delicately. <laughs> I don't keep breaking. It's not my fault. I swear to God. <laughs> That's the interruption right there. Kid Frost, I come back. Kid Frost is down a game and a round. Yeah, speaking of delicate, we got to be delicate about this approach here. Kid Frost is riding the razor's edge. Try to answer with that crouch. Pierce actually got blessed with the jump. Heavy kick the trade. Pierce coming through. And again, this character, you have to go for like perfect parry against the Pierce to try to like get your own Pierce off the knockdown so you can get in to get uh, some sort of pressure going. But it's only Goat Float coming through with the level three. Yeah, level three. You still have drive gauge here, so you can go for a drive reversal. But that's if Goat Float is willing to go in or if we're just going to set something up. Meaty Pierce. OD. Gets it with the second one. It's almost done. Goat Float. We go for a command grab. That was the OD. Overhead, departure. No, it's not a departure. I'm sorry, it's Amnesia. Amnesia, we spend all of our drive gauge just to get something started. We're sticking the leg out. Sweet Chip Music isn't going to save us in the 2H. Two heavy punch, crouching heavy punch. I thought that was Nerf. Oh, Lily again. Lily again. Up against DJ here, OK. It's the land of Lilies, the land of the Hondas too as well. Florida. Yeah, Chateau Definitely coming through. Out. Modern Lily. Florida this is the one that we saw bro. earlier on against JP, right, in the bracket. Modern Lily might. Actually, work out even better against the Firewall play from the side of DJ, but I think his normals are still pretty good up in this matchup. Yeah, I mean, they are good, but Lily, again, with those heavy normals, those are some of the obviously her strongest tools, right? Mm -hmm. Going for that crouching heavy punch again. Damn. Oh, the whip spire, that's gonna hurt. Yeah, wasn't able to get that DP off. Not the biggest punch off the squall. Perfect parry, he's ready. Crouch, fear starter, drive impact, attack on the gauge. You weren't gonna like kill that character, so why not attack the drive gauge? Not skilled after a perfect parry. <laughs> yeah, I love that, just going for the dive. Oh Go. no! Yeah, you're dead. The whip, get hit. Yeah, Sobata, seal the deal. The heavy one gets it done. Squall, first victory. All right, round start situation again. Chateau really likes to just go for walk forward at round start. Confident. You have that stand medium punch to kind of claim some of that space. That forward fierce back fierce, I guess. The wild horn also to back you up. There's the sway. Having to contest with the sway is going to be really important here. Ooh, but goes for a bit of a reset into the command grab. Does it take the time to actually get a stock up? Yeah, I mean, that's the thing about Lily, right? It's like you're trying to figure out when you can stock up. We get the Oki. It's, it's a deadly dance. Depends on the character and also person matchup. It's command grab, empty style. Ooh. One more hit. That'll be it. One touch. Yeah, but it's going to have to be a clean touch here. No chip damage is going to work. And the whip punish with the crouching heavy punch. Again, that normal is so dangerous. Last button right there for this character. What she relies upon for her anti-airs, confirms, drive rush up, you know. Probably the one you'll see the most from this character. That's why modern 
as long as it hasn't, it's still good. Yeah, for sure. And then you can just immediately get those easy confirms right into level three. Double dashes up. It's on the Oki. Normal throw. That's about to he shouldn't. Baits out the reversal. Not the biggest pickup in terms of damage. Stocks are up, though. That means more for the extensions. Yeah, honestly, surprised again that we didn't go for the level three in that situation just to get a big lead on drive and put Squall into the corner. The recovering time to get that DP just fine. Backs off, finds there the Fox Fear Starter. Level three for that victory. Or damn near close to it. Actually, you might actually just be dead since it started with Crouch and Fierce. No, yeah. still alive, but all oh, burnout though. Yeah, Squall surviving by the skin of his teeth twice in a row here. But ODs about to be chipped though. One more OD fire. Yeah, there, there it is. is. Chateau sending it out. Yeah, the only answer to that really was going to have to be going for a uh, some kind of a reversal, right? Yeah. You could have thrown out your own critical art to try and get something started there, but that's easier said than done in a high-pressure situation like that. Rubber jab starter. With the knockdown the sweep. Try to box it out. Stocks up every so often whenever they can. But that's a waste right there. Drive reversal. Actually, not that bad. Chat has got more drive gauge than small, so maybe not the biggest waste. Hey, but what did what did the legend Daigo said? Just because you have more resources and more health doesn't yeah. mean you're winning. That's true. A lot more things to consider for this one advantage. Look at that whip punch against a stand medium kick. But Squall's been too far out for some things to hit. It's been dangerous. Oh, yeah, just throwing out those jabs, trying to harass <laughs> Chato, answering back as well. You want to throw out jabs? I'll throw out some crouching jabs. Mm -hmm. No interruption. The drive rush jab working out, but still not too much off. Like, crouching this one would be fantastic. The command grab lands a Chato. He is on set point against Squall, who won Roundhouse. He was working his locals, interruption with the Crouch Fierce. That button does everything. My taxi takes out my dog. Oh, look at that. The whiff punish game on it is incredible. Nice backdash there, getting away from the command grab attempt. But still, you're stuck into the corner, and you need to find a way out. There it is. The DP bets it. Damn near would have died for that. The bar at the bottom would have been built up for level three, possibly. <laughs> Drive impact. No reaction from Squall. And the meaty stand light kick. This should be it. The level two. And Chateau, the modern Lily, is going to move on, staying alive here in the bracket. I've only seen that as like the sauce here from Paladin. Mm -hmm. With Thank a nerf, though, with the JP, that might help out, too. Stand Fierce nerf with punish. Yeah, we'll help. see how it plays out. And like you said, I definitely see those Hashu Gekis come through. Nice three, not a bad deal. Also, I think OD got buffed in some ways, too, as well. Sweet, yeah, the wall stuff off it. the feet. I love that. Yeah, Paladin, well done. Already a lot of low forward fireball action going on, right? My yeah. man's playing Street Fighter. There we go, the perfect parry. That pick up, the Topsy right after. Drop reversal to back him up a bit, but Paladin still has a corner advantage. Oh man, he'd love to get a hard knockdown again with that sweep. He's chasing it, a perfect parry. Gets a standing roundhouse. Straight to the donkey kick. Perfect parry on the jump fears. Still caught up in the corner. Go, go, gotta find a way out that jump fears. Definitely can bless that crouch fears. One of those more downward angle jump ins. Dangerous. Looking for it to get the trade. You'll take that if you're pounding. You still have the lead. Yeah, absolutely. We'll especially take this. Straight into the level two. Lift him off his toes with that crouching heavy punch in order to get the partial charge. Fantastic from Paladin. That sweep every so often coming through in the clutch. Go close. Difficulty approaching. Sweep again. Punish kind of situation. Little dash up for the throw. Tossed over the shoulders. You see, he's constantly trying to go for this perfect parry. He's already gotten it two times before. Checking him with the crouching light punches, not allowing him to move forward. Minus three, so gets the throw right after. Another grip. Oh! Another one, the punish counter, and the drive impact to get it done, Paladin. This is your character, not Luke. Ignore what's on the box art, bro. That's not for you. <laughs> this is the real main character, right? The original main character. Yes. Original recipe. Bro, he's throwing a more. Bro. Drive rush, medium punch starter. Meaty fireball to delete that if he went up with AOD Amnesia. Dash up throw, though. Now it's Paladin up in the corner. What's your response? Up back, though. Get back there, son. And toss him right back in. Trying to go for the sweet chin music. Big stretches. But still, he is brawling here back up against the corner. Parries the drive impact attempt. But the collarbone breaker is going to get tossed. For Perry on the fireball. The departure. Lock him down. Finds the overhead. Go for getting a conversion. Drive rushes up with the crouching medium kick. Drives get the shame on the stand fears. Level two, you know what to do off the target combo. Caught him oh. low with the crouching medium kick. This should be enough off the crystal slash. I lied to you. Enough for the finish. Goklo can now chip him out. Yeah, in burnout here, exactly. Very smart there from Goklo. Just back up, force Piled into overextend and make a mistake and capitalize on it. 
Kill the drop, get you kill the character. Now, sets up for the shimmy, the stamp here, still working out in the clutch. On hit, punish counter well for the follow up. Departure, overhead. Oh, the toss right back. Oh, he impact. is challenging! Oh, that so, was crazy how he utilized the drive impact there to try and armor through the OD Amnesia. Beautiful interruption right there against the drive rush. PP Ender, Shin! Shoryuken! Look at all that bar being sapped away with the OD Fireball in the wake up. Yes, it will! Try to burn him out, the Donkey Kick does it! No! Oh, no! Massive whip there on the light DP. He goes straight for the level one, but it's not enough to get the kill! He's so close to burnout, though. They stay alive. Coco has to face patiently. He tried rushes and trying to get the overhead with a big base yes. going home broke. That is the second time he has thrown the attempt at the collarbone breaker. He is just waiting to see him lean back to throw in that overhead punch and then just presses right on the throw. Yeah, no Fat Joe on that one. All evened out. Bro, you're always supposed to show that up when you're winning. Don't do that now. <laughs> <laughs> he needs a power up. He needs a power up. What is that? Light a cola? Oh, no, no. Oh, Shukeki coming through. This time we see the Amnesia against it. Oh, he tried to DP, DP, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. I like the idea. There we go. Yep, plus frames in your face. There's the shimmy right there on the bait. Stan Fierce to pick up the donkey kick. Frame kill did not get the meaty fireball. He'd like to have. Finds the word that you wanted previously. Target combo and the meaty donkey kick to get the kill. Paladin on set point. That was eight. You want to talk about meaty donkey kick. That hit on like the very end frames there. Perfect carry. Ready with the defense. Out some offense for the corner carry off the top. He's a look at scary. All right, trying to go for the parry again. I mean, the same situation has been happening over and over. Goku drive rushes on in. Paladin answers back with a parry, right? Because we haven't seen a drive rush up throw from Goku yet, so there's really nothing to fear. Damn, the Ford heavy kick lands oh, into level three again yikes. for the victory. Paladin takes the win. Oh. Perfectly done. Perfectly spaced, looking for that crouching kick to route things back. But it's all a part of Paladin's plan as he lands himself further in the bracket. Crouching medium punch is going to be huge as well for Kami. Kami's crouching medium kick is always incredibly strong. Now she just gets more options to utilize that. Mm -hmm. More calculative with that, the crouching medium punch. Ooh, careful now. Skyway arrow for the Oki. Be nice and medium. There's a whip punish on the side, a marathon. So crouching medium punch gets crouching medium kick. Heavy knuckle. Again, the measured approach here, you see, already kind of showing the hand that we have the dive kick available, that cannon strike. OD this time. Marathon getting hit with the dive kick. Luckily, it was a punish counter. Stan Fierce counter hit. Walks up the throw to reset the pressure. Drive rush on in. Get those plus frames. Dive kick again. Again, the aerial approach. Hard for Marathon to stop right now. Oh, and then the shimmy gets you with the standing Fierce. And you were right, Cole. A dive kick playing a huge part in this matchup, right? You want to like reach forward with these like stand medium punch, light punch, things like that. Even crushing medium punch, you might get blessed with the dive continuously. And finding an answer against Cammy is hard. Like every jump is a mix up. It's an empty low throw, the dive kick, the heavy kick. You don't know what it's going to be. Here we go. Perfect parry on the sandblast. And now Marathon back into the corner. Hasn't even gotten started running yet. But now nice. here we go. The buffer, crushing medium punch. Light knuckle, heavy knuckle ender. Dashes up. Perfect parry. Oh, he has been so on point with the perfect parries on those sandblasts. Oh, leads into level three immediately. Won't kill, but again, will. Execute. Prime position. I seen Mothman go for that OD hooligan. Interruption! Oh, what? Did you try to walk in my space? What was that, just wake up crouching medium punch? And there was like a little bit of a delay too as well. Good. Right into level three. Can he clutch it out though? Has to be careful, these buttons he throws out. Mothman. And these jumps, and you see we're going for empty jumps, right? Not going for the dive kicks here. Trying to bait something out, and There's there we a hooligan again to get in, and that's gonna be the win. The DP Ender, that's the other thing we see Mothman do continuously, especially when they're on the verge of victory, is land that hooligan. They know that you're stressed, and they see that you haven't really been checking the aerial approach continuously, and so they go for that OD hooligan to get the win. That might be something Marathon has to clock in on and get the crowd fierce against. Here we go, Marathon back into the corner. Familiar situation. Continuous with this pressure, that back medium punch. Harassing, continuously with the throws as well. It's Kimmy Kimmy. Let's take all the throws to the third throw. Will it be a reversal button? Box it low this time. Oh, but the trade there with the crouching medium kick. And Marathon's just trying to slowly but surely poke his way out of the corner. 
I think big though on that crouching meter kick a little bit, a little bit more. Punish counter light, knuckle. Yeah, we need to squeeze out any extra damage that we can get here. We're already so far behind. Burnout, impact, looking to clip a limb. Mothman recedes a little bit off these lights. Oh, Beautiful whip go. punish for her box on that dive kick. It's pretty damn fast. So clap it. Up in the corner. The wall the shimmy, but then finish off the plate. The wind right there. The shimmy comes through from Mothman. Oh. The stand fierce. It's been knuckle to seal the deal. Mothman on set point. Yeah, the unfortunate thing there was we didn't have the drive gauge to follow up after that crouching medium punch. Of course, we probably could have gone into something like level one, but we weren't confident, right? Yeah, that's key. Confidence with this character. Double the damage. Whoa! This wasn't even close to that ODDP. Sent the doubt. Mod man getting it with the drive impact on his wake up. Not the biggest conversion. Level three, we gotta spend it. I think you have to at this point. Yeah, you see him going to burn out. They usually go for that level three. For the victory. Ground and pound, you are definitely going down. Burns out in Memphis in the perfect KO. Bro, help. 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 <laughs> Alright. A lot of bar spent though, but I do feel like Luke, without bar, can still be dangerous. And he'll get that level one as the match goes on. Yeah, for sure. And he builds up meter pretty quickly as That's well. That's true. Yeah, battery. Damn! Once again, the crouching meter punch coming through in the clutch. Light knuckle, heavy ender for a lot of corner carry. And a lot of damage dumped off, too, as well. 25% already off the rip. Yeah, and then look, 50 meter, over 50 meter, already built as well. What was that mistake? The dive kick. Overhead. And immediately Mothman. challenges. Yeah, you see a little bit of delay on that jab. Just a slight delay. The turn back, the counter hit. Marathon not pressing the right button. ODDP, side switch. Hella blessed. Privilege DP. That's a, my dad's a millionaire DP <laughs> right there. I was able to buy a house at 21. All right, again, just checking also, making sure that Cammy doesn't steal those turns back. Got to throw out that crouching light punch. And it's kind of measuring too, right? You use the crouching light punch as a bit of a measuring stick to make them underestimate your range, and then you throw out the big one there, the crouching yes. medium punch to capitalize. Oh, careful, I thought it could have been whip punish. Marathon hunting for his opportunity. Mothman getting interrupted. That fireball. But she don't want like perfect parry in the dry rush up. Spin knuckle. No anti her again. This time, no bait on the shimmy. Yeah, this time not going for the jump and after the spin knuckle. Gets the throw in the corner. We're going to go for some loops. Oh. Reversal jab. We Just try. So far. 10 seconds left on the clock. Someone needs to make something happen here. Oh, he tried, but he ducked and avoided. DDT! You're free. Evening things out. Marathon versus Mothman. Going the limit. Final game. Vintage Luke. Vintage. Classic. 1970s Luke. Straight for the cellar. All right, there we go. With the spine buster. Oh, too short this time. Yeah. A throw recovery. Punish counter. DP ender right there off the spiral arrow. OD DP. That might be the first bust that we've seen from the side of Marathon. Mothman has been letting him rip continuously. The first one from the side of Marathon. Dashes underneath. Yeah, you saw actually Mothman went with, uh, I believe that was a rising JK as well, right? Mm. Kind of uh, putting out something preemptively in case Marathon chases the sky. Again, not going for any anti airs. At some point, you kind of have to go for a DP to challenge some of the aerial approach. Marathon leading right now the dive kick. Not falling for these shimmies anymore. Oh, oh no, that big is drop. Tragic. Back throw reset, Marathon. I love that. That drive impact. No, it's threatening it. Was expecting the jump out, right? But it's crazy. We were expecting the jump out, but we didn't go for an anti air. Right, yeah. That, I, I, I felt like that was like the kind of the play right after. Like, oh, I'll just do a DP because he'll definitely jump looking for that drive impact. There'll be an anti right there. Mothman puts himself on set point, but. We'll have to see. A lot of bar at the bottom here for Mothman. Level 3 could be on the way to finish things off or equalize. Uh oh, but tossed. All right, back to mid screen here. Too short there on the spin knuckle, but still, no whip punch. Dive kick hits. Spiral arrow for the Oki. Oh, whips the throw too far out. Try to attack and all the hits connect. Yeah, there it, it is. In terms of taking what could be coming through, you'll hold these throws. You know, you weren't going to die for that throw, so go for the tech. Makes sense to alternate your options. Now on Death Door, Marathon, what are you going to do? We the jabs. Are available, but this is a really tall task to handle. You got to play nearly perfectly here. Personal jab. Light knuckle. No follow-up 
after, and there you go. Gets caught right on the toes. For your wordsmith. Right? I'm a chef with words, but smelling words is way different, though. That's a that's a that's a way different hobby. You feel me? I feel you. I feel you. I'm about to feel this match here right now. They're going straight into it now. Scrot, of course, on the Luke. I everything coming through with the Lily. That's true. Classic Lily too. Drive reverse on the bus frames. Unfortunately, less bar. Have to be careful about being a burnout against Elite. She could definitely be a little gremlin. Oh, same with the follow up. Unfortunately, too far on the distance. The punish counter hit. All right, FD Jump tries to go for the throw. Nice tag there. Gets the hammer fist coming on in. Bro, the damage on that. See that perfect knuckle combo coming through? So never perfect. Get used to it. Perfect. Yeah, and trying to use those sand blasts to harass I Overthink and not allow them to build up stocks for free, but there's the perfect parry. Pack on Drive Gauge right there. Heavily scaled. Alright. The anti-air crouch it's fears. Anti -air too. It's Get so that good. out of here. Anti-air footsies tool. Mm -hmm. You know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of Faust 2K. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> it does everything, bro. It really does. Even more so. Empty low, crouching like a start or finish your plate. One more hit will be it, brother. Do it. Oh, but we're sending out that drive impact. There we go. You gotta watch out. That's two stocks of wind on, and we just go straight for the chip. They did a really good job of even over that aerial option. Yeah, maybe DP would have worked out for the anti air. Maybe they would have got punished. Maybe not. But I like that bet. I overthink. Did not overthink that interaction. First victory to them. Crouch, fear situation for Fierce. Wild Horn. Knockdown, drive rush. The area right there. Ooh. Jumping in again. Feeling froggy. Oh, but here we go. Perfect knuckle combo once again. Goes straight into the level two. Beast mode, baby, to make sure you put them in burnout. Great decision making there from Squat. Time to capitalize. Yeah, it is. Drive rush forward with a medium punch. Careful now, bar is heavy from the side of scroll in terms of drive gauge right go for that drive impact at some point he does on the wake up to put this kid to sleep the jump fierce back heavy kick it should kill actually yeah perfect level one right yes into sir it. and we got the cool route too the anime route anime route we are anime out here tns9 definitely showcasing the anime in this game too as well scroll so we up another bar too as well if you want like these smoke Talked about how he's a battery. We can build that up as he goes along. Crouch fierce again. Stocks it right in front of his face. ODDP. Punish counter. Drive rush back throw. Damn. Yeah, put you right back into the corner here. Great spacing that we're seeing. Goes for the ooh, drive reversal. Okay. Just wants to make sure that we keep I overthink in that corner position. Don't want to give them too much room to maneuver backwards. And there's the whiff punish. Straight into the level three. And it's gonna burn him out as well if it doesn't kill. That's true. Don't kill. But I mean, damn your death. She's got two stocks. She chipped you out continuously. So we're going for light kickstarter. Ooh. The cap. We hit the beast mode. <laughs> Just like that. Now I overthink some burnout. Damn, look at the damage. Damn, you're even. Oh, she's going to get in. She's got no stocks. Yeah, her Fast fireball. She's got to jump in. Oh, the Condor dive. The pop off. Hey, it might not be a dive kick, but it gets the job done all the same. It does. It definitely does. Hit the pickup. The perfect. Heavy Knuckle Ender up in the corner, I would think. Backing up, looking for oh, a dash up. I thought it was going to be like a throw or a punish, but it wasn't. All right, rushing on in again. Scoop the leg. See, constantly just trying to utilize other buttons mostly, again, as that measuring stick to make you get used to their range so we can get you with the crouching heavy punch. Yes. That's so the money maker. That character. Yeah, so much that she gets off of that. But those other buttons, like stay medium punch, they don't lead to too much. Mm -hmm. It's just setting up shot for the other stuff to make them drop. Stocks up once again, stand light kick. Cross up, light kick, punish counter. Atlanta recovery, beats up the ODDP for free. I overthink on set point to move on to top eight. Could you imagine a world where Lily is in top eight? All right, here we go. Nice throw tech. Set right back into the corner again with the drive reversal. Drive throw. Tick throw right after. It's the low this time. Scrawl. Should we be able to finish this off? We'll drop the combo. Right into the overhead, Ooh. the perfect KO. Scrawl staying alive for another round, but is not out of the woods quite yet, Cola. Not yet. It's Three not over. On both sides. Watch Fierce, Wild Horn. DP Ender to stock up. Get some distance with it. Stocks up again. Scrawl, I feel like it has more. Yeah, more of these fireballs, especially OD, to like prevent her from doing so at that distance. You're inviting. Her to be able to stock up if you're not checking and challenging it, or at least putting the idea in the mind. Yeah, plus, that, that really allows her game plan to get going, right? Those plus frames that mix up off of the blocked uh, wind up spire is so scary. But the damage on this is going to be scary as well. Buying some more time for that drive gate to come back. Yeah, Scott has a bunch to utilize. 
He drive rushes in immediately. Yeah. Counter conversion. This has been that level three just yet. Or see, I should say the drive impact. Gone. That's dead. That's definitely dead, brother. Take her to Memphis. Yeah. All right, and one a piece. Dental plan is all the fist land. <laughs> Eat your teeth like cereal. <laughs> Holding me to Captain Crunch, bro. Brother, that actually is like the teeth killer right there. Captain Crunch. It's good, but <laughs> why am I bleeding after eating cereal? Anyway. Yeah, bro, you could feel it melting your teeth. <laughs> it really, it's cutting the upside. It, it's it's bad, pretty much. It's really bad. Oh, that damage is bad too. Coming through. Yeah, we need punch. Pace tester. Oh, we are not holding on to any of those plus frames at all. Oh, Scrawn no. figured I'm, I'm not going to deal with that. I'm willing to get rid of my drive gauge if it means I don't have to hold the incoming mix up. Whatever it takes. Again. But put yourself in burnout. That's why we see the drive impact right back, though, from I overthink. Put yourself in burnout when they got bar like that is kind of bad. Now, caught up in the corner. One more drive impact. The spy, the follow up. Good kill. I overthink just merely gets. The wild horn and the fall right after. I overthink on set point. Yeah, once again, last time we were on set point, though, Scrawl was able to lock in and bring it to a game three. Can we lock in and close this all out? Perfect parry. Can that gauge nice and healthy? The heavy kick right after. What was it that had them in a fireball? Absolutely had to. This will jump, but no big follow up. Scrawl scrambling right now. And scramble's not where you want to be. And look at this suddenly from a scramble to immediately slowing down the pace. Yeah, I would think definitely staying solid. They got the bar to utilize in terms of like the wind spires. They got the OD gauge, perfect parry. Punish, you're just attacking the drive gauge. Not a lot in terms of damage. That doesn't matter though. Oh, nearly got a whiff punish there. But speaking of whiff punishes, I think this is going to be it. Straight into the level three. Yeah, Headphones off. are off. Controller disconnected. <laughs> There's the kills. I overthink moving on in the bracket.